All right, there we go. Hello, everyone. Welcome or welcome back to the stream, as always. I am Forever Mad Dog, and today we are playing some more Echoes of Wisdom. Um, yesterday, when we played, uh, we completed the Elden Volcano Dungeon, and then we did a whole bunch of side questing afterwards. <coughs> we have the ability to hold as many accessories, not as many accessories, up to, I think it was five now? Yeah, five accessories. We got a bunch more accessories, got a bunch more heart pieces. And, uh, yeah. Um, yeah, so today I want to just do a little more exploring and then go to the Holy Mount Lanayru. But yeah, as always, I hope you're all doing absolutely fantastic today. I myself am doing pretty all right. And, uh, yeah, I hope your day only begins to get better. Or, I hope your day only gets better. From here on out. I have the second half of my monster from yesterday. I ended up not finishing it at <laughs> last stream. So, I just kind of wrapped it up and put it in the fridge. My nose is. Uh, <laughs> feels like some, something's tickling my nose. I never came here, I realized. That's not what I wanted. <laughs> I wanted that. Gotta, guess I gotta come back here to do it, huh? Oh. Oh! Okay, sure. Let's see. Hello, are you visiting your dead as well? This is a very old and storied graveyard. There are legends about ghost sightings here, hidden staircases, things like that. I used to love hearing my grandpa tell me stories about this place. Now he's buried here too. Please don't do anything to disturb his rest. Oh, I will. Oh, I will. Oh. Oh. Oh, maybe I just have to like these. Okay, it was just that. I wasn't sure what exactly I had to do, but it, it looked like it could move. I hate this chair. That's not bad. I can move forward a bit. Hi, Bella. Hi, baby girl. Hey, sweet kitty. What did I just... Whoops, I didn't do that. Um, absolutely not. Ow! Rude. Fuck him up. There you go, I fucked him up. <laughs> uh, posture a little, a little better, that'd be pretty cool. A teddy bear? Why teddy bear? Wait, where'd the teddy bear go? Did the teddy bear break? Okay, it's back now. No, I don't want I wanted this one. Come on. Yeah, that works. Stuffed toy echo. A cute plush little guy for creepy unknown reasons. Ghosts are drawn to it. I don't have any recipes for, um, or not recipe, I don't have any side quests for a teddy bear yet. I'm over it. Let's 
I have this wall. I don't know how to get past the wall. Hmm. Ghosts don't respawn, so I don't think it's that. There's no, uh, underground map for here, so. Alright. Pick up the box, thank you. I don't see what I'm supposed to do. There's no hidden staircase. Put up with the food. Yes, yeah, put up with the food. That's kind of cool. It actually, shows that you're hitting your head. I have no clue. <laughs> it almost looks like this one can be moved, but it's probably because of its position. There's nothing in there I can control to uh, to bring it closer to it. It wouldn't be one of these. I don't think it'd be one of these, right? No, you don't attack peaceful creatures. Okay. Okay, so that's not a button. Okay. I wasn't thinking, like, what if that's a button, but no. This door here is closed, too. Ow. My knuckle, my knuckles. That actually hurt a bit. That was a pretty rough pop. I don't think the ghosts have respawned. No, they have not. Oh, maybe. Just maybe. Okay. Cool. The ghost can hit it. I didn't even consider the idea of the ghost going through the wall, but that seems to be the case. Um. Hello, all of you. How about I give you all a Lionel, huh? There we go. <laughs> yep. Oh, 
Oh, that was easy. It's very quiet. That's why it's very quiet. My speakers turned down a lot. There we go, and I can hear the game properly. The Guinea Level 2 Echo. The largest type of guinea, this monster has a huge eyeball and tongue to match its stature. Huh. I thought that was going to be a mini boss. No, it was just a large ghost. <coughs> okay, Golden Egg's cool. I was kind of hoping for a heart piece, but okay. Speaking of which, how many heart pieces do I have right now? Two. Okay. Oh, it seems like that's the only one I can open right now. Or not even right now, just like in general. So, okay, good to know. Yeah, I haven't seen these guys yet. The Ribbitoon. An amphibious crooner whose golden croaks draw other monsters to it, which can be useful as a trap. Oh, okay. Interesting. We're getting a whole bunch of rupees now, which is cool. A cave I haven't been to yet. Yeah, I don't think I've really explored this water area too much. Okay, I see how I'm or what I'm supposed to do. I just need to figure out how to do it. Um... Three jars of floral nectar. Nice. Oh, I need to get rid of the bed, of course. Unequip that. And re equip the jump one. And then I guess unequip the sword one. And re equip that. Oh, it's an underwater cliff. That's not a, a wall. Okay. Ooh, a stamp. Okay, I'm going to check this first then. I honestly didn't, didn't see how many, how many that is now. We have three now, okay. <laughs> I just kind of zoned out while it happened. And I was like, wait, I didn't actually look. Whoops. I can't dive very deep, huh? No waterfall cave? Disappointing. Whatever. I guess I'll live, but... Not having a waterfall cave is a missed opportunity. There's something up there.
There's a... Right here. Yeah, cool. That's the first time our bell went off, so that's cool. Nice. I, I actually really like that. That's really cool. Someone tells me that looks like an icy house up there on the map. So I assume that's on Holy Mount Lanier, so we can't actually go up there yet. Uh, Hole Mill. Hole Mill? Did I pass it? I, I passed it. Hole Mill. There should be some right here, though. Oh, a cave. See the problem, it doesn't reach. Not quite at least. Yep. What if I do this? Where's the boulder? Yep. Damn it. No, it doesn't reach. Shit. Yep. I have an idea. Okay, it's not gonna work then, unfortunately. How do I get something over there then? <laughs> Almost definitely not how I'm supposed to do it, but I did it. <laughs> I get all yeah, almost definitely not how I was supposed to do it, but it 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 worked. There is another one out here. All oh, right, I can have six now. There we go, six. I kind of want to go back to the Eastern Temple and go in there again. Is 
it's around here. Oh, right here, probably. Yeah, there we go. I like this one a lot. This is this accessory is really useful. Cause there's just so many micros that I never would have found otherwise. Kind of cool. She has a unique animation for if you jump after a spin. Did I come down here? I had to have, because I went to these caves. Oh, yeah, of course. No, this is where we started. That's where we started. <coughs> Go to the Oasis. I don't think I've talked to anyone in the Oasis since we completed the, uh, the stuff there. Might new, be a new quest here, I'm not sure. Apparently a might fragment here. Or a might crystal somewhere around here. Around here, really. Right, you're the one I showed the flying tile to, right? Not in the oasis here. Maybe it's under the chest. No, it's not. Maybe it's a Slurpee shop? I, I really don't know. I think we've done all the side quests over here. I don't... I didn't see... I could check down here for caves, I'm not sure. I want to check over here by the old dungeon. Okay, well, it doesn't look like we can get into the old dungeon, which is unfortunate, but whatever. I guess I'll live. Doesn't look like there's really much of anything else over here. Was there anything over here? Or did I get it already? I may have gone already. So can these like burn or something or what? No, I don't think they burn. But there is... Oh, right here. Okay, no, I've been to that cave before. Apparently. Right, that was where we could find the horse, so... Yeah.
Okay, maybe? Yeah, okay. Yeah, all these different spots for uh, Mike Crystals, I never would have guessed. <laughs> I've been in that cave before. Supposedly. Up, please. Thank you. Can I climb on top of this? Probably, right? No, it's an invisible wall. Okay. Unfortunate. I don't think there are any side quests in here, so on that yeah. If there will be any side quests eventually, we'll have to wait until later to find them. Anything up here? I didn't actually see, but probably not. Ooh, stamp! There is something up here. That's I've never been up here before. And when I got the stamp, the immediate thing I thought of was, um, Spirit Tracks. Which I'm pretty sure Spirit Tracks had stamps, right? It has been a long time since I played Spirit Tracks, so I don't remember exactly, but... Ooh, Heart Piece. A bunch of enemies, huh? But as I always say, Spear Tracks is painfully underrated. It is, as the clickbait titles like to try and say, the best Zelda game that nobody talks about. The only time I ever hear it talked about is someone, it whenever somebody's like, oh, Spear Tracks, that one has the trains, right? Ew, trains. <laughs> and it's like, you know, if you actually tried to fucking play it, you'd find it's actually, like, a really interesting game. Oh, the Lionel's unaffected by the re-dead screams, that's interesting. A cave I haven't seen before with probably the mic crystal in it. Oh, this is that spot we saw in the trailer. Yeah. It'd be funny if the uh, the beds became number one. <laughs> We're just allowed to do that, huh? It's kind of crazy. Okay, I see the button that needs to be pressed, but... Ooh, five rupees, just... Give me the... There we go, thank you.
Nice. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to want some warm peppers or some warm uh, drinks for uh, for Mountain Lanaria. And here's the mic crystal. Cool, but what's the other way? Oh, I already have to 12, huh? Chest. I'm guessing probably it's like a ingredient. Yeah, rock tater. Okay, cool. Mm. I almost just walked off and then it I immediately saw the gap and fuck, okay. Gotta jump. Probably under here, if I is where it's pointing, if I had to guess. Yeah. Stamp we've already gotten. This is that beach here that we started on, just about. Or the top of the beach where we started on, I should say. I don't see anything up here, which is a shame, but whatever. Like, I get that it's easy to get to, but you'd think that, like... Some people just wouldn't explore there? I don't know. There's one nearby, huh? Oh, probably that rock. Cool, does still have some of this carbonation left. Yep. Not as much in there as I thought there was, but. Yep. Wait, this is. the old water temple. Or oh, it, it was. It, it's, it's the water temple. It's the water control area. Yep. That becomes the water temple. In the dark world. Cave I haven't been in yet. Okay. Oh, there is stuff here. Okay. I was gonna be like, oh god, it's another fucking dead end, but no. Nice. <laughs> I thought I was thinking like this seems awfully small for a boss fight, but hey, nice, fifty rupees. Okay, sure. Okay, not, not over there. In the water. Sounds like it. Oh, right there, okay. I was admittedly kind of hoping for a, uh... Ow. An underwater heart piece, because I only need one more for a heart, but okay. Like, sure, I don't have to, I don't have to beat the game today, but I would like to beat the game today, if possible. Where's the hole now? There you are. Okay, none of those are actually dig spots, unfortunately. 
Oh, I haven't been to Southern Village in a while. Maybe there's new side quests down there. Chili, fluffy, and totally white. <clears throat> That's what snow's like. And I learned that from Link. He taught me Hebrew mountains covered in snow because it's super cold in northern Hyrule. But white, fluffy, and cold all in one thing? I want to see something for myself. I can't go all the way up to Hebrew Mountain until I'm grown up. Guess I'll have to wait forever. Okay, so we're going to get in a snow echo and bring it to him. Hmm. Hello there, Traveler. Mind if I bend your ear? Things have been messing... Things have been a mess lately with the rifts and marshes and whatnot. It's got my wife worried sick. I was thinking I'd cheer up and bring her something rare. So, I go on a little walk and what do I find? A giant plant that flies! Oh, you know, near those caves deep in the forest, I lose sight of the thing. Now I'm half convinced I imagined it. I have no idea if I'll ever see that plant again. That just sounds like a... a pea hat. What? That's it! That's the plan I saw! You took the time to go find her for me? Well, thanks, Traveler. I have to go grab my wife. She'll want to take a look at the... Huh? This thing's not a plant at all. It's a monster! Help! Whew, I really had no idea what I was dealing with. I'm sorry you went on your way to bring it to me. But, well, there's no way that I would have cheered up my wife. Honey, you went through all that trouble just to make me feel better. Othera? Othera, did you hear all that? Well, your voice does carry. You know, there was no need to do that all for my sake. I'm perfectly happy as long as I have my darling husband with me. Aw, oh, shucks. You've always been good at making me blush. Once things settle down, Othera, what do you say the two of us do some traveling? That sounds nice. Tonight, let's think of a place to go together. You got it. Thanks for bringing what I asked for. Here's something for you. Hmm. Oh, nice. This is what it was telling me about. Okay, cool. What about Seaside Village? I hear Lake Hylia is lovely, too. There's no need to decide now. We've got all the time in the world to mull it over. I guess we'll probably go inside the houses too to look for quests. Cause that's the uh that's them. Hmm. Ow, my chin is all itchy. No accessories? Okay. Mm. Oh. We almost have a thousand rupees again, wow. Well, yeah, I guess with all this rupee collecting. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, I don't think we're going to find anything new over here, so... I think... Unless there's a... Oh, I can go check out the Deku Village, actually. There is a village I'm potentially missing. Or that, that I haven't gone back to. Okay, we'll check out this village, and then I will head over to Heap Mountain. And Annie! Sure smooths are in, but I'm staying loyal to cotton candy, even if it's impossible to find. Which do you like better? Cotton candy! Really? You agree? Then you'll want to hear this. I was searching for cotton candy when I heard a voice ask if I wanted to play a game. 
this shit again. Yeah, like that. Good impression. Anyway, I turned around and the big th and, the, and a big thing of cotton candy was floating there. It went poof before I get my cotton candy stick out. But it was real. I know it was. Now, why am I telling you this? Because you're going to help me track it down. I saw it in the room south of here. The one with the frogs that make it rain. I heard there's an entrance that goes underground, but don't quote me on that. Okay, I will... Go do that first. I need water. The room is to the south, huh? Then almost enough for another upgrade. Okay, maybe? There's a frog here, so. This looks rather bombable, but... No, it doesn't seem like it. Okay. Oh, I see. I, I, I think I see what I gotta do. Oh, you're not dead? Okay. That's disappointing. It's just the two, right? Yeah, it's just the two, okay. Another Ignazole. Let that torch. There we go. Hmm. That must be the underground entrance that the Deku Scrub mentioned. That I'm not supposed to quote him on. So don't call him. It sounds like a dungeon. Yeah, we found we found the place. I can kill these things, can't I? And I can get an echo. Pretty sure I can.
Yeah, there, I can get an echo of it. The spark echo. Ow, fuck, my chin. Hmm. A strange entity that moves along walls. It is wreathed in electricity and will shock anything it comes in contact with. Okay. <laughs> so this just becomes easy then, I guess. Oh. I can't actually put a bed in there, can I? Oh, I can! Oh, come on, it's so close. Oh wait, it worked! There we go. Ow. Hmm. Why am I so fucking itchy? I saw it as I pressed plus. Hi, Bella. And now I no longer saw it. There it is. need another box here, right? Ah, that still hit me. Okay, it's back. Nice. 
me one more. There we go. Oh no, the boxes are gone. Okay, now we'll come back eventually. Yes, good. I want to add, hopefully it'll come back eventually. I know I could have just cheesed it. I just put three sparks in there myself, but... The puzzle actually seems to be kind of fun if I do the puzzle the way the puzzle's meant to be done. Oh, hello. We're in 2D now. I knew you wouldn't be able to resist a rematch. I have prepared for this day. Oh yes, this time I will not be defeated. Alright, starting with that, huh? Ow. Rude. Those two should meet up. Yes, good. Now I need to find a way for these two to meet up. Maybe I can put like water here? No, nope, that doesn't do it. Maybe if I put water here and then I put a block on top of the water? That'll do it. Or, instead of doing that, I can just... Summon in the Lionel. Not meant to do. Whoops. Oh, that was close. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Okay, now I need water. And I need a table. That's gonna work, so I want Lionel. Nice. But, oh my training! 
<sighs> I know what I'm beating. I'll admit it. You won. Oh, he dead, dead. Give me my heart piece. Give me my new 16th heart. You got four pieces of heart. Your maximum number of hearts has increased, and they've been filled. Nice. Anything over here? No, just some pots for health and stuff and whatnot. Cool. So that's 16 hearts now, that's cool. That's very good. That means there is, there's definitely one heart container up here. There might be another heart container in here. So there's, uh, eight or 12 heart pieces left. I'm not 100% sure on that number. It's one of the two. What, you found the big thing of cotton candy? That's great to hear, take me to be found, I'm starving. It turned out to be a monster, so I can't eat it? Lies! You think you're sneaky, I see what's happening. You wanna hoard it all, that's not fair, I'm the one who found it! Hmm? What's that you're holding? That's a charm? Used to be all the rage in Scrubton. But that one's not finished. Oh, I get it. You want me to finish your charm before you tell me? Well, fine. You just flip this around, click that in there, and done. Ancient charm became a curious charm. Greatly decreased damage. Ooh, cool. Attach the parts. It looks like a scrub's face. Cute, right? So now you'll tell me? Oh, come on. Stop lying to me. I know it's real. I will find that big thing cotton candy again. You just watch. Damage reduced plus. Very nice. Friendly warning. I'm a friendly scrub, so I'll give you a friendly warning. Stay away from Boozoo. All they do is whine. They're so annoying. The most annoying scrub in the world. I can hear you, numb scrub. Bempoo's the one you should stay away from. They're bitter and nasty, and they enjoy hurting my feelings. Oh yeah, well, I'll cut it out if you beat me at hide and seek. Uh, you know I'm bad at hide and seek. Ha, huh, tell you what. If you're that worried about it, I'll let you team up with someone else. Then you, I want you on my team. Fine by me, just say when you're ready. Sure. Then close your eyes, and I'll find a place to hide. Game starts and I say go. Go. From the hint, you'll find me near the trendiest shop in town. Is that by any chance the smoothie shop? Oh. I found a deco snake, then I can buy all the smoothies I want. Oh, you were listening to me? Well, in that case, I have no choice. I'll make you an, my, an ally in my money making mission. Now, you know about the deco snake, a creature kept by deco scrubs. No one's ever caught it, so there's big money in, on an offer if you do. Catching Deco Snake is a quick and easy path to fame and fortune. And I know how to do it too. I'm going to use bait to lure it out of hiding. It loves electro apples, a specialty of the fair and wetlands. So as my new recruit, I'm, I need you to go out and get three electro apples. I'm just a brain, so I'll hang back. You found me? Um, that was a warm-up round. Let's go again. Close your eyes and I'll find a new place to hide. Game starts when I say go. Go. Friendly hint, you'll find me near a lake that's a symbol of love. That's like... Way down here. How did you run over there that fast? Like, holy shit. 
Like, I can teleport, and I still took longer than he did to, to get there. That was a flower. Okay. You found me again? Guess you're a student of the game. I'd better crank up the difficulty. Close your eyes, then I'll find a place to hide. Game set starts when I say go. Go. You'll find me between four stone sib four stone siblings. Four stone siblings. Maybe like around here? Or like around here? I'm not sure. Could even be down here for all I know. Oh, I want to go back to the prison too. There was stuff to do in the prison. Now that I have a tri rod. Oh, right, that's the snow thing. If I do this, it doesn't just. No, it doesn't. Okay. Ah, yes, over here. Oh, come on, again? You left me cho no choice. I have to pull out all the stops. Close your eyes and I'll find a place to hide. Game starts when I say go. Go. Friendly hint, you'll find me near a home that used, used to be covered in dark thorns. There's no way you know where that is. No, not at all. Is that still marking towards the same place? Yeah, it is. And that home was... Was that down here? I assume that was down there. I actually don't remember the exact location. But I think it was down here. Yeah, it was. Yeah, I'm really grateful we got rid of the dark thorns and I have my home back. The only problem is nobody visits me anymore. Do you want to hang out? Aw, you found me. That's not fair. You should have said you were a pro hide and seeker. I can't compete with someone who does it for a living. You sore loser. Just admit you lost and quit teasing me like you promised. But I... I... I tease you because I'm jealous, Boozoo. What? You're so good at making stuff, cotton candy and smoothies, so I got jealous. And when I was better than you at hide and seek, I guess I let it go to my head. I'm sorry. So that's what it was about? You could have asked me to teach you how I make stuff. Instead, you just hurt my feelings all the time. You called me annoying, Bamboo, but you're the annoying one. M me? Oh, he's dead. <laughs> Is that how vicious mockery works? Well, thanks for helping me win. Here you go. Fairy Fragrance. Oh, is it like an upgrade version of the... Am I annoying? Was I too harsh? I thought it was okay to make a little fun as friends, you know? But I guess teasing is pretty annoying. I'm glad you get it. Now, do you want to go home? Mm. Wrong one. Oh, yeah, that, that is an inc increased version of the Fairy Flower. Cool. that off and I want what did I have on before oh right it was a knockback spin but that's really not that useful so more rupees <laughs> uh, I guess I can go back to the village right because I can turn in three electro apples to that one Deku Oh yeah, no, I'm really far away from the from the village. <sighs> I 
Are there, there's no more side quests over here, right? Oh, maybe you? Maybe down here, maybe you. Oh, this is the prison. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go into the prison before I take on that quest. This is the clink, the who, the who, who You know, the small room with bars for bad people. Hang on, you're the one who put in here. You came back? We heard you saved a bunch of Deku scrubs, so you're free to pass. Only thing is, the guards inside won't know we let you in, so keep your wits. If they find you, they'll throw you back in the cell. Hell yeah, let's go get fucking imprisoned again. Oh, this is the entrance right here. Okay, cool. And yeah, now that we have access to the, uh... To the tri rod again. Now I can like actually explore here properly. Ah, bitch. You can't. You thought, but you can't. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Why is this working? It stopped working. <laughs> it was working. I still have the tri rod. There was something down there, like a chest or something like that, wasn't there? I'm almost sure there was. It was just five rupees, was it? There was a hard piece in here, but we got that. So it may have just been five rupees that we left. I'm bored. Can we go outside? We could go to Blossoms, but the Dark Thorns are gone, so it's not that great. We can't be seen in Scrubs and we'd get told off for not working. Uh, you know, someone overheard this, we'd be in real trouble. That's not gonna happen, nobody comes in here. Hey, come on, don't be such a scaredy scrub. What? what? Who are you? You are the one who got rid of the Dark Thorns of Blossom's house. Uh oh, what if she tells on us? There's only one way to fix this bribery. Take this in exchange for your silence. <laughs> you got five rupees, whether you wanted them or not. She looks so sad. You accepted it, which is the same as agreeing. So you can't tell one soul what you heard. Keep that mouth shut tight. <laughs> so I just got five rupees for free. Nice. Okay, so nothing too horribly interesting down here, I guess. Wait, was there some? Maybe there was something down that well, I'm not sure. But it's worth a check, I guess. How or why that works, but it did. <laughs> I absolutely should have been caught there, but I guess they want to be nice or something. Uh, 
boomfish. Kaboomy fish. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, play. Place, spin, grab. Ooh, honey, yes, please. Oh, he fell. Okay, that's fine. Nice, good job. Proud of you. We had the tri rod while we were in here, though, so. Where's box? Box. It's so slow. Really? a little bit of health. Oh, guess no, there was nothing else. There was nothing new in there. Except for 10 rupees we could get. Go grab this side quest then. Why'd you pluck me? Couldn't you see I was hiding? I was hiding from the leaf eaters. They'll eat all my leaves. I'll go pale and I'll wilt. And then I'll be dead! Ah, oh, stop saying stuff like that! Sorry. Look, if you go into the jungle, watch out for a swarm of Mothulas. We ran into them in southwest fa s s s Southwest? Southeast fair and wetlands. Those Mothulas, they attacked us and munched on our leaves. We got off a few bite marks, but next time they eat our leaves whole. Uh, now I'm gonna have nightmares about Mothulas. Okay, so I go to this guy and give him three of my electro apples, and then you go to Southwest Fair and Wetlands. Mm, yep, three electro apples. I'm gonna hand it to you. You really came through. Here's your cut. Nice. Arteries form in the body bodies of monsters. Soon that technique will be all mine, and the money will roll right on in. Smoothies galore, and when that gets old, all the finest meals in Hyrule. Though, all the finest meals is a lot of meals. Not sure I can eat that much. What do rich people spend money on? It can't all be food, can it? Hmm. Might need to give us a rethink. If I want to get a bunch, a bunch of money. We only two rupees from all that, really? That's a little disappointing, but okay. I guess if I really wanted a bunch of uh, rupees, I'd just use the uh, the goldfinch.
Yeah, I mess him up. Fuck him up. Yeah. He's not dead yet. There we go, now he's dead. Cool, now we can go back to the, uh, the village and turn in this quest. And then, I guess, now head up. To, uh... To the mountain. I guess I should say my goodbye. Bear. I guess I. I guess I should say my goodbyes. My only regret is not drinking more smoothies. Give it a rest. You're bumming me out. You're right on time. Soon we're going to the big vegetable patch in the sky. <sighs> you d defeated the Mothulus? So one of these aren't gonna get snatched? Which means we're gonna live. Hooray! Life goes on. I'm gonna drink smoothies by the bucket! You've been a good friend to the Deku Scrubs. Here, have this. I, okay, I figured because the thing was going off next to you. Thanks for saving us. I love being alive. 18, only two more, and then we can uh, get the next upgrade. So, uh, all right, the sweet spot dungeon. I guess that's just about everything we can. Did I did I ever come over here? Is there a cave here? Probably not. Cause I've probably been over there before. I I guess let's go climb the mountain. I don't know if we'll find eight heart pieces up there, but maybe we'll get quests or more. Maybe we'll just eventually stumble upon some more as, as we explore. You're a guard, why are you scared of the snakes? too early. That was also too early. There we go. Damn, I still didn't make it. <laughs> uh, I need water.
There we go. Now I can go up again. I'm going real high up, huh? Don't want to get squished. What's in here? We got ah warm peppers. Cool nine. That's ow. That's a lot of peppers. Did, but it's probably important. Oh, uh, um. I think I get it. Okay. Oh, yeah, I see. Okay. Ah, no, 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 I'm gonna miss it. because I wanted to spin. I didn't make any warm foods. I have one for five minutes and then I have another for one minute. Okay. Are those s s snow pokey? Snow keys? That's probably. I don't know. It's probably cold up here, huh? Very rather cold. Looks well, like the rift has spread to the whole mountain, too. All we can do now is push forward, Zelda. Well, I'm not taking cold damage yet, so that's cool. Maybe it's specifically for, like, the cold water? I'm not sure. Snow Mall. Strange and hostile cr collection of living snowballs. This creature's true body is the head. It can regrow lost snowballs. Ooh. A stamp. That's five. There's only five more now, I think. Hi and hello, Stamp Guy here. I've loved stamps since I was a teeny me. Now I'm Hyrule's ultimate stampologist. You fill up another stamp card, so here's what I promised you. 
Oh, cool. You finished your fourth card? Amazing! Big applause to this long-lasting rally. You're a natural. You really are. Keep it up. Stamp perfection will surely be yours. Say, what is it about stamps? I mean, why are they so satisfying to plunk? As rivers flow and petals flaw, as love holds youthful hearts in thrall, stamps, plunk, that's all. But why, you ask, do they plunk? Just for fun. Stamptacular, even. With that, here's the next stamp card. You got the final stamp card. This is the stamp card bestowed upon true stamp rally masters. The back is autographed by the stamp guy himself. Okay, all together now. Ready, set, go stamp rally. More stamps are out there somewhere. Where could those last stamps be? Probably on the mountain if I had to... You're shivering, Zelda. You're going to be okay? It's windy and snowy, but you're much stronger than before. You'll freeze before long. Can you bring out something to keep you warm? Oh, it's not just in the water. It is just, like, in general. Here's Zelda wandering the mountain in her fucking silk pajamas. Levers? I don't think there'd be snow levers. That's interesting. You learn the lever echo. Patient subterranean monster. It waits for prey, then bursts to the surface, rotating its blades to attack. What's down here? Oh. Nothing, apparently. Maybe over here? No, it's something around here. I don't know what it would be, though. Oh, that, was that an ice keys? That is an ice keys. The ice keys echo. A flying monster shrouded in a zone of frigid air that can freeze enemies solid. Nice. Where? Is this? Hmm. I have no clue. Oh, maybe it's over there. It's it's over there. Okay. What the heck are you? He's sleeping. Wait, are there new keys up here? What's that strange sound? What is that? Well, he's seeping. Brr, if not for that warming smoothie, I'd be freezing my leaves off. Can we hear mountain because I I heard it had twisted pumpkins. But it's just snow, more snow, and those funny-looking snowmen. Here I was, hoping to reel in customers with tasty twisted pumpkin smoothies. Oh, my dear twisted pumpkin, where are you hiding? Here you go. That's a twist p p pump. Twisted pumpkin. Wow, I never seen one in person before. That pretty swirling shape, that shiny waxy skin. I'm in love. 
I'm good and keyed up now. I'm gonna open up shop right away. Here, for helping me out. Thank you, actually. You're more beautiful than I heard. What a stunner. I'm not cool at all now. The burning fire in my heart is keeping me warm. Hey, rocks. Uh, smoothie, please. Hadn't I? Oh, no, I used... I did that to make cold ones. This is making warm potions. Hey, Stern. He drives... Makes food both out of anything. True. True. <laughs> A piping hot potion. For five minutes? Cool, good. Give me a couple more. I kind of hope we'll get warm clothes. I mean, again, it is my fault for coming in here wearing fucking silk pajamas, but... That's my fault. <laughs> but hey guys, how's it going? Okay, I think I'm good. That's like 15 minutes worth of cold of this. Does this immediately turn to ice? Yes, it does. Okay, so they... Oh, it's a block, though. That's awful. Not bad, kind of tired, but that's okay. Fair enough. Mix up Saturday games? Alright, sounds good. Wait, so, like... Mix it... What do you mean, mix it up? Like... Phasma... Like, a Phasmo and lethal and stuff like that? Or, like, grounded and Phasmo and lethal? I don't think I have anything to wake you up. Can I wake you up? I don't know if I can wake you up. Electricity. Okay, alright. I will throw on the schedule and then I'll probably have an uh, October schedule up today then. After stream. Ow. Do I have anything that can wake people up? I don't think I do. Maybe the smell of food. So like... Meat. Maybe a fire? Where's the fire th Here it is. Brazier. No. Okay, all right. Oh no, it broke! Yeah, I think this problem must. Okay, yeah, I, I, cause I, I know, uh, I think it was somebody. I think it was you, sir. Mentioned, I mean, it was rocks who said. Somebody said Phasmo for October. So, yeah. <laughs> I legitimately can't remember who exactly it was, but somebody said it. Sounds like you think, yeah, I just, again, I, I just wanted to make absolutely sure that we, uh, we wanted to do uh, Phasma and stuff during October. Yeah, I was so happy last night. I mentioned it on, on my Discord, but, uh... I was... This is a game. A, a game I was gonna play during October, and I looked it up on Steam, and it was like 40 fucking dollars. Well, someone... It is possible someone said it, yeah? But yeah, so the game I wanted was 40 dollars, and I was like, you know, I can afford that. But, so I decided to go to Google, 
and it's like four dollars on a uh, on PlayStation Store. So I was like, okay, yeah, I'm just gonna fucking do this then. Undoubtedly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can copy that actually. Ice block echo. Like most ice, this block slides when pushed and floats in water. It also melts in the heat, again, like most ice. Huh. Cool. And for all, for all the Zucosis playthroughs. Right. That looks like it might be. I think it like just had to official release or something, didn't it? That could be really cool. It did? Nice. Ow. Nice. Yeah, that'll be really cool. Maybe I can put the Brazier here instead. Grab the Brazier Echo. Which is here. Ow, I'm on fire. I mean, at least I'm not cold now, so that's kind of cool. Oh, yeah, icy water's cold. Uh, I have ice blocks somewhere. There they here they are. Oh, that one real far, huh? Oh. I see the problem. Or even my jump boost, I still can't jump that high, huh? Yeah, that's, that's gonna be real cool, Zucosis. Crap! No! There we go, thank you. Um, then I want the... There you are, Strangula. Crap, not there. Not there, here. Here, maybe? No. Ah, god di I gotta do the brazier because the, uh, the Ignazol will just burn it. Well, it'll just burn the boxes I'm on. Okay, now I'm curious. Can I? Was there a way to go up there? Out of the water, out of the water. Thank you. Oh. Right here. I missed this apparently. Some nectar. Not honey. I called it nectar before. Uh, I called it honey before. It's nectar. Decidedly not honey. Come on. No. There we go. Uh, we're fine. I can make that. Because it doesn't look like there's anything actually over there right now yet. So, yeah. That's fine. I can just... Throw a line of this thing. Ah. Ah. Be 
he's not hitting the switch. So this whole cave was just for a chest? That's fine, but... I'm going again. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just saw the fucking... The bad drink or whatever it's called. What's that thing called? The... Unfortunate Smoothie. <laughs> that is such a good name. Okay, where the hell we go? Somewhere around here. This one, maybe? One of these has a, uh... A thing in it. Unless it's above me. It may, may very well be above me. Unless it's in the cave, I just didn't see it. No, I check, I, I'm pretty sure I checked everything in here. I just drank a smoothie. I'm going to let my smoothie actually work before I go back in. Oh, I have to talk to his butt, not his head. No, no, please don't leave Conda here. What? Conde was only sleeping. Oh, who are you? Did you wake up Conde? Conde? Thanks, small one. You too, much small. What? Oh, you can see me. Of course Conde can see you. But small ones, aren't you cold dressed like that? Conde has an idea. Why don't you stay at my house until the snow blows over? Oh, oh, yes, that is one of Conde's best ideas ever. Let's go together. Please follow closely so you don't get lost in the storm. He's got a lantern. That's cool. Wait, wait, don't go. He's too fast. He's so fast. That doesn't look safe. The bridge is broken, but we need to cross here to get to Conde's house. Conde can still get us there fast. Wanna get there fast? Yes. Alright then. Climb on my back, small one. Ooh, that's a big jump. Holy shit. <laughs> Where'd he go? Disappeared so quickly. I smell... I smell fried chicken. Either someone's frying chicken, or someone has brought home KFC. I don't know why I would have brought home KFC. It is... Uh... It is 2.30. It is far too early for KFC. Okay, do I use... Wind or fire for this? I can sense my friends from here. I can make the rift engines up ahead. We can't do anything in the pile of snow. Maybe we should take shelter in the storm. Oh, okay. Hey! So here we are at Conde's house. It's warm and toasty inside. Well, maybe Zelda wasn't wearing fucking pajamas. Maybe she'd be fine. Oh. Welcome to Conde's house, small one, and much smaller one. You won't freeze in here, given that it's all it's roasty, toasty, and all. We do have names, you know. We're more than just small and smaller. I'm Try. This is Zelda. Oh. Zelda and Try. Conde can remember that. So Zelda and Try, you're welcome to rest here until it stops snowing. Since we're saying names, Conde should say this. Conde's name is Conde. How nice to have guests. It's been, well, a long, long time. 
What did you two come up here into the mountains for, anyway? Fixing rifts? Three goddesses? Conde doesn't quite understand, but it sounds hard. We're trying to reach a different mountain, Holy Mountain Laneru. Do you know how to get there, Conde? Laneru. Laneru. Oh, Conde does know that name. Big Brother told me about it. Your big brother? He's a great explorer. His adventures take him all over the place in a hot air balloon. Big Brother says his next great destination. Des destination? His next great destination was Holy Mountain at Laneru. He said he was going to launch a flight from the top of Hebrew Mountain to get there. Conde waited here along with Dad until Big Brother returned from his adventure. Zelda and Tri, I hope your adventures are going well. The snow is coming down hard, but it'll ease up soon. You two are welcome to relax here. Conde's home is your home. Been here for a while, Zelda. What a relief! I can't jump on the table. It's so disappointing. Oh, is this Conde's family? Conde made that picture. Big Brother taught Conde many things, like how to crush rocks to make paint. He's part of my family, close to Conde's heart. Just a little earlier, Conde saw Big Brother. He was walking here on the mountain. Conde saw him from behind and called out. But he vanished into the storm. Conde chased after Big Brother, but couldn't find him anywhere until finally. Conde fell asleep in the snow after all that running. Maybe Big Brother will come home soon. Conde's Daily Diary. Today was sunny. My snow patrol was the same as yesterday. Today was snowy. My snow patrol was the same as yesterday. Today was very snowy. My snow patrol was the same as yesterday. Uh, this goes on like that for a while. <laughs> He's got a Christmas tree. I just noticed that. I didn't even see the Christmas tree before. I'll leave you a present. Um, there you go. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Has stopped snowing hard yet. Rest here just a little longer. You can pass time by looking at things in Conde's home if you want. Oh, okay, yeah, same thing. Those are my cleaning tools. Conde used them to clean his mountain. Dad used to clean the mountain with Conde. Some of those are actually his tools. Oh! It's not snowing so hard now. The time has flown by much faster than when Conde's alone. Anyway, now that it's safe to go outside, Conde's going out there to clean. Wait, Zelda and Tri want to go to Holy Mount Laneru, right? Head to the top of this mountain. That's where Big Brother launched his balloon. Dad, Conde promises to do his best to give the mountain a good cleaning today. Oh, here goes. Hey, nice job, Conde. I'm proud of you. You did it. Oh, goodbye. Seems like cleaning means something else to him, like removing the snow. I sense my friend somewhere inside there, Zelda. We're not going there yet, though. Oh! That's a uh, moblin camp. Nice. Mess him up. Where? 
I don't see anymore. Unless there's one like frozen in ice or something. Which I guess wouldn't be too surprising, but... Lionel's cost got, got reduced. There's no. Oh, maybe in here. Okay, there we go. That's the last one. Because, like, yeah, the Lionel is really, really good, but taking up all six slots is a. I guess the trade-off, you get the best combat for, uh, for a little less, uh, for not being able to have anything else out in summon. Seems safer in here, which is cool. That's not what I wanted to put down. <laughs> uh, here. I'm a Lionel. Oh, that was it? Okay, cool. I'll take it. An energy belt. Oh, cool! So we'll upgrade to the uh, that one thing we already have. You can upgrade to the glove, and that was energy. It's energy plus. Nice. Okay. Cool. Okay, that's it. Nothing special in there. And we have so much energy in our bar that we don't really have to worry too much about running out. But I guess having energy is nice for the rifts at least. Oh, I need to drink another potion. There we go. Oh, hi. Connor's got to clean up this mess and before Big Brother gets home. It's not working though, still Connor won't give up no matter what. Huh? What's wrong? Khan is cleaning up this dark gunk, trying and trying anyway. Gunk? Do you mean that rift? His gunk has been messing up things all over these mountains lately. Khan has to clean up this before Big Brother gets home. You can't get rid of a rift that way. Really? But Khan is pretty sure this will work, just need to try harder. Um, but... Try, thank you for wanting to help, it makes Khan happy, but this is something that Khan needs to do. Okay, time to clean up... somehow. He's not going to listen to us, is he? Well, Conde, I'm proud of you. You're trying. Oh, 
I do want this. Well, there's just a small bit of rift here, huh? Great an entrance here. Stand back, Zelda. Ow, it's she. I can sense my friends here. They're trapped. There's in five areas to be exact. Next to them all, we can fix this rift. Oh, it's slippery here. Yeah, I can walk now. I jumped into it and set myself on fire. At least I'm not cold now. <laughs> this does mean that my, uh... My strategy is just spamming fucking... Uh... Water everywhere isn't gonna work anymore. Yeah, I can just jump up there now. I'll go this way. Cool. Uh, bed bridge time. Unless I can use water. Oh, I can use water, okay. Never mind, the water strategy is still viable. I see the problem. Trying to use that one because go through here and it's way easier because I have way too many fucking echoes now. Ow! Asshole! That was so rude! Ow! Chest is itchy. I need to heal a little bit. Which where those silk pajamas come in handy again. Oh, we can go down past from where we started, okay. So we can. Not far down, but we can go down. That's just right here, anyway. 
A little bit of arson never hurt anyone. Okay. Found all my friends in this area. Now we can mend this rift. So we get a little more experience for try, and we get um, we get a couple more uh, mic crystals. My friends share some of their power with me. Ooh, that's actually a lot. Cool. So like two more, and we get to up to level ten. Two mic crystals. I think that's enough. Yeah, that's level tw uh, that's twenty crystals now. Cool. Very nice. I didn't see Connor's brother in here, which is a little disappointing, but whatever. <laughs> oh wow, that dark gunk is gone, Conde was right to keep trying. <laughs> he doesn't waste time, does he? That roof we just saw was fairly small, I wonder where we can enter the huge one. Huh? I sense my friends, they're somewhere above us. Let's go to the top of the mountain, Zelda. Not yet. Uh huh. What's here? Ah! Not what I was expecting to find. of Ignizal. Ooh. Ah! Oh, wait. I can learn that. The Snowball Echo. I didn't... Here we go. This large ball of snow rolls quickly downhill. While it's painful to be struck by, it's surprisingly fragile. Oh. I was hoping for, uh... My crystals. But okay, well, uh, that's fine. Oh, not quite. Okay. Kind of point that just being near them doesn't like immediately kill them. There we go. Ow! Oh wow, there wasn't anything back there, huh? Oh. <laughs> When I'm on fire, I melt the ice too. Cool. Oh, uh, and this is the cave behind his house. Okay. Mmm, I see up there. Does this freeze immediately? No. Why is the ice not melting? Weird, I don't know why the ice didn't melt. 
But it's fine. Nice, it's 21. I'm like this way. Oh, it's 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 chilly over here. I have to make some more uh, ice-proof potions. Monster guts. A lot of monster guts, actually. Interesting, I guess. Oh, they're not even a cave over there. Okay. But I do want to come down here. Go get him. There's the mic crystal. That's what we saw earlier. We need to go up here, huh? Well, uh, this one's sparkling, so. Now, we melted all these before, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we did. Alright, I guess let's head back to uh, his house then, because I don't think there's anything else here for us. Or at least I didn't see anything else around here. I wonder if, if we will find a village up here, because so far we've only found his house. This is not where I wanted to warp to, but I will take it. Okay, monster guts are actually the useful ones for us right now. I think the horns are used for the cool potions, but... I think an extra 10 minutes should be good. I mean, we have a warp here next to him, so I can get back here easy enough. Oh, good! I do have a warp next to his house. Good, good, good. I just went to the wrong warp, but it worked out because I, I wanted smoothies anyway. Okay, so it turns out I had less moss than I thought I did. So I'm actually going to be right back. I'm going to go make myself some tea quickly. So I'm going to be a couple minutes. So yeah, I'll be back shortly. Okay, hold on a sec. Um, apparently I don't have the capture card on the beer right back either. Put that under there. Okay, there you go. I'll be right back.
All right, sorry about that, guys. I'm back now, and I have some tea with me. So let's go ascend the mountain, then. There's nothing else here, so. I like that the ice is still broken. That's cool. I'm assuming that, that enemy is probably still in there, so I'm just going to not worry about them. What the fuck did he get to do here? Oh, I guess he did jump, so yeah, okay. Bitch. Snowball? Yeah, snowball. Okay. Nice. There's probably something up here, huh? Yeah. Rupees? Oh, dark mo mo monster stone. Mine. Ha! Idiot. Stupid inanimate object. Not super excited for an ice dungeon, because ice physics, but. Oh, there's a lot of cold water up here, huh? Is this bad for me, even with the. No, I can swim in this water even with the, uh, the potion, but probably without the potion, it's probably cold. That's where I'm supposed to go, so. Not that one, not not that one. That one. Of course. I know what I need to fight you. Honestly, this will probably work. I was thinking of getting a fire wizard, but I don't need one. You want the ice wizard, Echo, a mighty caster of ice magic. This, this creature warps across warps across the sky, freezing enemies with frigid blasts. I didn't want to do that. Okay, there's one of the next ones I need. One of, again, eight or twelve. Depending on exactly how many dungeons are left. I'm not entirely sure of the number. A chest underwater. Thank <laughs> you. 
Let's see, yeah, the water is cold and dangerous while I don't while I'm not under the effect of a potion, so okay. Good to know. Ah. I suppose these are brand new Octoroks, too. Oh, it's not too... It's not too deep for you. Cool. This monster freezes souls with icy spit. The cold within leaks out of its head. I didn't want to do that. You fuck off. Now I can actually fucking walk. I can move while 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 it's out. Let's see. Okay, now let's go in the cave. We've got two heart pieces here, that's cool. Huh. See, bitch. Huh. Oh, the water stops it. Nice. Ah. Oh, one of these things, huh? Nice, that works perfectly, actually. There's not really much point to having- Oh, that's to get back. Okay, I guess. <laughs> oh, it's just one. Okay. It's just one and I created a whole fucking swarm. Uh, which way do I want to go? I want to go this way. Oh, there's a chest here. Sure, that's very nice. Fine, I'll just give you a monster you can't fight against them. 
What is this thing? A freezer? It is a freezer! I, I, I vaguely remember that name from Ocarina. On spawning enemy, this monster will blow out icy breath as it implacably pursues its quarry. Nice. Nice. There's a throat. That wasn't like at all a threat. Okay. He's like, oh look at me, I'm spooky and frozen. He broke up and then died, because I killed him. I can't hit with any pots. They either hit his spear or they hit the Lionel. Or the Lionel sword. I didn't press up in time. <laughs> it worked, I guess. Very bright. Uh, it's just snow, but it looks like the brightest light coming in from outside. What the fuck are you? Oh no, my Lionel! Oh, it's right here. Okay. What? No, it's there. It is. The Moa Echo. Fiercely protective of its allies, this floating monster fires eye beams at foes with no one to protect. It calms down. Huh, okay. I don't see anything here. Probably above me. Oh, there was nothing down there, okay. It didn't get crushed. Cool. Good for you, Ignazol. Ow. Rude. Oh, this is where I'm supposed to go? Almost. Almost the top. Conda hasn't come here in a long time. Huh? 
Oh, is that Big Brother? Oh. Hey, hey, Connor, I've missed you. It's been so lonely around here. Oh. Goodbye. What? Why are you running away? Where are you going? Oh, it, is it in Among Us? I, I think he might be in Among Us. See, I came this way because I thought this wasn't the correct way. So I suppose I have to go the other way then, huh? I don't have to, but the other way is the not correct. Ooh. Ow. There's a heart piece over here. Surprising. Oh no, the trampolines sink, don't they? Yeah, they do. Okay, so I can probably get up there by just coming this way then. Ow. Chest. Oh, okay, I'll get up. <laughs> hey, nice. 50 rupees. Yes, please. That's right here. Oh, it's over. Where the fuck did my tea go? It's right in front of me. Something's supposed to be here for sure. Where's the hole now? There you are. Hmm. Perhaps not. I don't know then. Looks like there should be something there. Okay, so this is the way I was supposed to go, I guess. There's almost definitely something up there. Not what I wanted. Crap. The thing is kind of not what I want to do.
Oh, there's something up here. I was right. Ow. Oh, there's just monster tanks. Okay, that's just... That's nothing, then. Is it like a hot spring? Yeah, it's a hot spring. Nice. What are you? The Temper Tweelis. When attacked, this rage-filled rock monster moves much faster and heats up to scorching before cooling again. Interesting. Ooh, Rocktato. Yes, please. Was that Conde? Big brother, what happened? Conde thought Big Brother had come home and finally caught up with him. But then he knocked poor Conde down. Are you okay? D don't worry, Conde can brush off an avalanche, just surprise, that's all. You don't seem like a normal self. Conde doesn't feel like his normal self. I don't understand, Conde. Why would he do that? You've been waiting for him for so long. Maybe Conde wasn't good like Conde was supposed to be. Good? What do you mean? On the day he left, Big Brother said, "Be good, Conde." Sometime after that, Dad became one of the one of the stars in the sky. So Conde's been all alone. Conde's been waiting for Big Brother to come home for a long time. And lately, Conde's been thinking, "What if Big Brother Nate never came back home because Conde wasn't good?" Oh, poor Conde. So Conde has been trying his hardest to be really, really good, thinking Big Brother would come home then. I see. What will you do? Will you go after him? Well, Conde saw Big Brother go north of here, but Conde isn't going to chase him. Being knocked down once was enough. Conde doesn't know what else Conde can do. Sorry, Zeldin Try. Conde wants to think here by himself for a while. Oh, poor Conde. His brother's definitely in Among Us, but like... Poor Conde. He just thinks his big brother hates him now. Wait, what? I thought we needed the hot air balloon to get up here. Footprints. These must be Conde's brother. He must have gone that way. I can sense my friends inside this rift. We're getting very close. I can create an entrance here. Stand back, Zelda. I don't have an amount of uh, uh, guys here, so this has to be where the dungeon is, but like. Yeah, I thought, I thought we were going to a different mountain. Because they were talking, like, oh yeah, you can reach Holy Mount Laneru from Haber Mountain, but. Cloud? 
and the Cloud Echo. The still world has pacified this cloud into something you can stand on for a short while. Okay, interesting. Very interesting. Now, how much of a while is a short while? It's just like jump off it immediately, or just about? Yeah, okay. Okay, there's nothing down there. All right, good to know. Ah, you bitch. Try hitting me again before I, uh... Damn, okay. Oh, right, I don't press B to go up, right. direction I'm supposed to go in. I just wanted to try to show, so this probably isn't the way that I'm in. This probably isn't the story way to go, I guess. Uh, where is... Did I pass it? No, it's probably further down. There it is. You son of a bitch. That should be enough then. Um Alright, they cost three, so any more and and they would would be too much. There we go, cool. I could just use bombs from Sword Fighter form, but this is far more interesting. It started to work and then it stopped working. Um
the, that way. Hopefully, I won't lose the echo this time. God! Or maybe I will, who knows. Shit, I still lost the echo. Oh, I didn't! It's right here. The Free Slug Echo. Lurking on the walls and floors of the coldest places, this creature leaves a, leaves a path of freezing ice behind it. Sounds chilly. Sounds very cold. Very, very cold. Stilled Holy Mount Lanayru. Huh. Interesting. So, go beat him up. Cool. Is it still cold? Yep. I'm frozen. Hi, baby girl. Hi, Bella. Come here, sweetheart. Do you want to come up, sweetheart? I know you don't like me picked up at all, but hi. Oh no, you're getting food. Okay. She eaten. Hey, she really does hate being picked up, so I'm not even gonna try. Okay, that's gonna be the, the temple. What's in here? Really? Oh, I see, okay. Ah, shit. Oh, the cloud's gonna be near the top, right? That's the ceiling. Maybe if I use water. I still didn't make it. There we go. I assumed the cave is where I was supposed to go, but I guess not. Some platforms over here, actually. Oh, he just threw himself off the edge. Okay. I guess that's where we were supposed to go up there, huh? Boring. Oh, 
I can just do this. It's easier. What's all this? A large picture with lots of writing. Let's see, what does it say? My balloon trip from Hebrew Mountain way up to Holy Mount Lanier was a success. As I take a quick break, I'm leaving all this here as a record of the happy occasion. I'm going on this adventure alone. Dad thinks I'm ready to take over his work this time. My dear little brother, Conde is in good hands with Dad back home. He'll be looked after. I'm anxious about going out exploring the world by myself, but adventure calls. I can't wait to bring Conde with me someday. He'll love it. It'll be even more fun. Now, onward for more exploration. Conde's brother must have left us here. And I bet this is his brother. So Conde had it wrong. His big brother doesn't think anything bad about him. You know, Conde saved us from that bad storm. I think he really deserves to be happy again. Hey, Bella. 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 Oh, silly girl. Just like the footprints we saw outside the rift. Lanayru Temple, nice. I see some sparkly in the corner there. Oh, okay, pumpkin. Oh, uh, it's cold. I can't do anything with that yet, I guess. Okay, I need to move that eventually. I was thinking like maybe we'll actually get a dungeon uh, or an item here, but it doesn't seem like it. In that case, I almost definitely have to figure out what to do with here. Okay, it is, it is just simple as that. There we go, cool. Oh, it's a heater. Okay, cool. Makes sense, because it's supposed to be like a... Yeah, because Din's supposed to be like a representation of heat, I guess. Or maybe that's just supposed to be a representation of fire. Not heat. Or not Din, I mean. Not heat. I'm dumb. Ah, fuck you, idiot. Cloud, cloud. I 
I did it. I think this water isn't dangerous, so that's cool. Key for there. I don't have a key yet, so use something here. Then. Okay. I, I expect me to grab that one, I guess. But all right. Oh shit! Okay, I, I see. I see the problem. That's actually really cool. I like that a lot. So I can change this element by pressing it into one of the things. That's cool. Oh, there's a key down. Oh, I see. I see what it wants me to do. Okay. Okay. Grab the key. Okay, do I need the key? Or the heat? Look, the cool? I uh, probably. Okay. Yes, that's what it wants me to do, so I'm gonna cool down anyway. Let me come here. Let me grab this. And we make it cold, and then we put it on here, and it freezes the water. That's actually really neat. I like that a lot. Oh, okay. Just break that immediately, I guess. Staircase. <laughs> Probably not how I was expected to do it, but that's how I'm doing it. Just do water. Um, maybe a cloud. That didn't work. Maybe I can put a strand over here. That's how I was supposed to do it, but that's how I did it, and it worked. It worked. <laughs> and somehow that worked too. I don't know why that worked. It shouldn't have worked. It's not what I was planning on doing, but it worked. Oh, I saw these two things. What the fuck? Or something up there. 
Interesting. <laughs> yeah, I probably deserve that, huh? Stood on it for too long. Ah, oh, shit. Nice treasure chest, probably rupees. Or a golden egg, that's interesting too, I guess. the ceiling there, huh? But there's a staircase there, isn't it? Yeah, it's a staircase right there. How do I get up there? Maybe one of these has a key in it. The ladder. Is that the thing I was looking for, the ladder, probably. And the rest don't have anything in, so this is probably the only thing I was looking for. Oh, that's where we put the thing, okay. Maybe, maybe if I use this, the torch slug. I think it was honestly just easier to use the, uh, the thing. What are you called? The sea urchin. Okay. I can't let it, I can't release it, can I? No, I can't. Maybe I can do this, actually. 
don't want it there. I want it. I don't want. I don't want it there. Thank you. There we go. There we go. Cool. There we go. <laughs> okay. So not to be that guy, but can I just... Oh, I gotta press him at the same time? Oh, of course. There we go. That's gonna be the key, right? Yes, cool. Nice. Oh, the door does open. I thought maybe it's kind of button or something. Okay. Oh, the map. Nice. Cool. That's a very big open looking room up here. I was gonna say almost like a mini boss room. Okay, maybe I have to freeze you. Maybe I have to get on top of you. No. Not electricity, okay. Still not entirely sure what I'm supposed to do, but alright. I'm gonna hit you with snow.
I have an idea. I don't know if it'll work though. Okay, no. No, it's not making land on ice. Oh wait, I, I, I might know. Try having I'm trying moving him under the rocks that fall. That might work. But I wasn't a rock there. That didn't do anything. It only hurt me. I didn't do anything. Do I have anything else that might hurt him? He's frozen. I don't know how I managed that, but he's frozen. Okay, so it is just Frieza. I, I figured that out an accident, but alright. There's two!
not exactly sure how being frozen in hot spring water works, but okay. Okay, there we go. Cool. We did it. <sighs> that was a little bit intense. <laughs> Especially the first bit when I had no clue how to actually fight him. That's bad water. That's also bad water. Is this bad water? No. It's only if it's touching the freezing water, I guess. No! Oh, he's fine. Nice. I thought he was dead for sure. <laughs> he did the ice goal, just. He just ignored it. Which was really funny. I don't know if I can even get him to go up there. Ow. Maybe I'm not supposed to have him go up there. Yes? No? Ye yes! Good. <laughs> so I don't know if I would be able to get that one to go up there, but I got the other one. Oh, you flew into the... There, you can rest now. You did good. He lit the torch. That's all that matters. That's a fancy button over there. Ooh. Oh, I need to heat it up, huh? Oh, they're four each. I thought they were... Okay. Ow. Rude. I thought they were three each. Hmm. 
What the heck? Can't do anything there. I can go in here though. Okay, let's start by killing all the enemies in here first. it now. I'll we'll destroy all these blocks. Then I want a boulder. Now I can grab this and bring it over. For some reason I forgot that I can jump while I'm while I'm carrying something like this. Okay. Cool. the bat room as well okay that's that's nice oh okay really summon that so triple threat p oh no the piats underwater there you go three piats i don't have this tech tech yet the tech tech level two echo well it has a thick shell and sharp leg spikes a single glaring red eye is a dominant feature of this tech tech variant Bed. Uh, bed. Bed. Oh. Made a little disappointing, but okay. So I can't actually do anything about that. Okay. Okay. All right.
And you can get this room now? This door's closed. Oh, I see. Okay. I need a boulder. Okay. I know how I'm supposed to do it, but it's how I'm doing it. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's creating co copies of itself? Pretty cool. A new variant that, that summons more enemies. The white wolfos echo. Large than normal wolfos. This white variant can summon its smaller kin with a with a towel. Oh, it only costs five. That's cool. Okay, where are we trying to get this? Over here. Button. Oh, cool. That's a shortcut now. Cool. Good. Oh my god, I left the room. Good. Thank you. Handful of echoes to use, so that might be good. I did want to heat up that room. Oh no, I want to cool down that room. Wait, what? Why would I want to? This room? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I do want to heat up this room. Okay. Okay. It should be like right out here, I think, right? I believe I want this to be heated up, so. Can I just throw this at this? No, I, I cannot, okay. <coughs> and I believe I want heat. I'm pretty sure I do. Yeah, I do, I do. No, I 
want to cool it down. I think. Unless it creates more spikes, and that would be kind of frustrating. But it shouldn't. Okay, that should work now. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to have to change it twice. That's interesting, though. And that gives us the boss key. Nice. Then I guess we go down the stairs to get to the boss door. This has been one of my favorite ice dungeons because it's all about, like, it's not just about, like, oh, ice and ice physics and stuff. It's about, like, ch choosing if you want to have ice or hot. That's really cool. It reminds me a bit of the Great Bay Temple, but less confusing the Great Bay Temple. Not like the Great... Not like I don't like the Great Bay Temple, just... It's like Great Bay Temple light. Alright, let's go. Uh, I'm probably not going to want this, but just in case, we'll get a line already. Oh, you're the boss, of course. Is that Conde's brother? Something feels really off here. We saw how Conde's brother looked in that painting. Nothing like this. There's no way this is him, Zelda. Gore chill. I probably want to. Frozen. is all so not stuck in there, so okay. I've been flattened. Uh, how did I do that before? I don't... It seems like this is this is exactly what I'm supposed to do. Nothing. 
Can I hit him? Now he's got a fire helmet? Yeah. Hey, no more ice physics. Cool, thank you. Uh, now I don't know... I don't have very many... ice creatures to hit him with. That's not what I was expecting at all. It doesn't make sense, though. That doesn't work. Okay. Ow. I have ice keys. Maybe ice keys. That seems to be working, okay. <laughs> this kind of place is working. Where are you now? Another- Both! No. Yes? No? Yes, both, okay. Let me do that. Oh, he can just swap between them, okay. Where's the ice keys? I could just use the ice and fire keys instead of, uh... He's just shooting the ice keys with the, uh, or the fire keys with the fire attack, so it's not fucking doing anything. There we go. The Lionels definitely make it easy. Oh, yeah, the, the Lino, not not multiple. I can't have multiple, unfortunately. But it definitely makes it easy. Hey, and there's all the rest of the uh, the tries from here, because we we learned that they're all apparently all called try. That's the Holy Mountain Lanier, then. Surrounded by clouds. That's cool. I hope his brother's still alive. My friend shares some of the power with me. Level 10, let's fucking go. And just over halfway. Okay, or about three quarters away. We can do even more now. Nice! Hmm. 
no Lionel decrease yet. Oh, we probably won't get a decrease in Lionel cost, which I, yeah, I guess it makes sense. Got five Mike Crystals. It's not quite enough for an upgrade. We already had enough for an upgrade though, but. Oh, right, the last of the uh, goddesses. Priestess, your wisdom has freed this land which was swallowed by nothingness. I am the goddess Nehru, one of the three who created your world. You have demonstrated true, wi true wisdom, thus I grant my sanction unto you. Now I have all three. And do we take all three to the forest, I'm guessing? Maybe? You got Nehru's sanction. Priestess, we three have borne witness to your true nature. Now, to open the path to the prime energy, go to the ancient forest guarded by the sacred tree. There, you may also encounter the hero you seek. Ooh. Remember this, your wisdom will one day be your salvation. We've gotten all the sanctions. Now we go to the ancient forest guarded by a sacred tree, and Link will be there too. Poor Conde. He had no idea he was chasing that creature this whole time. And that means he's no closer to reuniting with his brother. I wonder if he'll be sad about that. Poor Conde. There's not really anything else to do in the Still World for now. So let's go back to your world, Zelda. Okay, I think your mouth is supposed to be open. It just looked like uh, lipstick, but I don't think it is. <laughs> You've got a heart container. Your maximum number of hearts has increased, and they've been filled. That is, what, 17? Yeah, 17 hearts. Do you want to turn your world now? Yes. Okay, let's go. Zelda, try. where were you? Conde was worried not being able to find you anywhere. You left so fast. Huh? The mountain. It's clean. It's clean everywhere. What? You two took care of all that dark gunk? Then you two cleaned the mountain. Wow, thank you. That made Conde happy. But... What's wrong, Conde? You and Zelda are much better at being good than Conde is. Much better. Big Brother wouldn't be so disappointed if Conde was as good as you two. He's not disappointed in you at all, Conde. Don't lose spirit over any of this. Your brother said he wanted to take you on adventures with him someday. Well, what do you mean? So Big Brother's still on his adventure? Conde was only seen in the back of some big monster? Conde feels... better. But you've waited so long for him to come back home. Aren't you sad that he's not back yet? Not at all. His adventure isn't over yet. That means he'll be back when it is. But you're back to winning again. <laughs> Only until he comes home. And he will, so Conde can wait forever. Is Tri worried about Conde? I just want to make sure you stay in good spirits, Conde. You helped Zelda during that big snowstorm, after all. Oh, uh, well, Conde will stay in good spirits, as long as Zelda and Tri stay in good spirits. Thank you for telling me about Big Brother. I'm glad you're feeling like your normal self again, Conde. Conde's never felt more like himself. Good spirits. Great spirits. Ow. Oh. Hooray! <laughs> Looks like Conde really is back to his usual happy self. I hope his brother comes home soon. I'm glad we were finally able to take care of the rift on Holy Mount Laneru. And now we have that sanction from the goddess Nehru too. Zelda. The ancient force that goddess mentioned. I don't know where that is. Maybe your father knows. 
long have I waited at this moment? Uh oh. Is Void? Uh oh. Zelda! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that's not good. <laughs> the goddesses have provided their sanctions, so I should be able to approach the prime energy. Mm. Yes, this identity should suffice. Zelda? Uh-oh. Ah, Zelda, you're awake. Oh. After you clasped, after you collapsed, Tri brought you here to the castle. We're watching over you and waiting for you to wake up. But what has happened? Oh. I see. The goddess spoke of an ancient forest with a sacred tree. Impa, do you know anything? Any, do you know anything of this? Hmm. Yes, yes. It must be the eternal forest. As for the sacred tree, well, that must be the beautiful large tree located there. So it's the forest northwest of here. The trees are dense, so navigating it will prove challenging. Challenging. Hey, Zelda. No, must have been planning this from the start. They wait until you earn the right to seek the prime energy, then create an echo of you. That's why they imprisoned the goddesses in the rifts. To lure us in and advance their plan. If only I'd realized this sooner. Well, this is rather discouraging, isn't it? Discouraging? Oh, he must be in this feeling. Discovering Null Null's plan so late? Yeah. I feel very discouraged. Null might have been obtaining the prime energy. If that happens, our best chance will be to join forces with Link. The goddess has shared that if you go to the Eternal Force, you may find our hero Link. Zelda, as your father, the truth is I want you to remain here. It pains me to consider you stepping out into danger once again. But now I understand, you are the priestess of wisdom. As king, I must ask for your help. Please, go to the Eternal Forest, find the hero, and put an end to Null's nefarious plans. Please, priestess, save Hyrule. So that sounds like it's endgame then, but I'm not ready for endgame. Princess! Whew, what a relief to see you safe. I was so worried when I heard you were attacked. I've been waiting outside nervously, awaiting any news from the King and Lady Impa. You, you're not leaving again, are you? Are you? Yes, we're leaving. We're going to the Eternal Forest. Oh, the Eternal Forest, you say? Well then, allow me to ensure that the eternal force is safe for passage. If I leave anything to you, then I won't be worthy of my office. If I leave everything to you, then I won't be worthy of my office. Please, I insist. Right then, with that, I'm off. Ah. Uh, oh. We didn't have a chance to tell right the important part that no one made an echo of you. Hey, it'll be fine. I don't think I ever checked Castletown for quests, did I? I really don't think I did. Hmm. Impa had a quest for me, but that was just to get... Clothes? I can't remember. <laughs> hmm. What's so cool? Oh, princess! Look what I found, isn't it cool? My very own... Rami discovery? 
Oh, I, your name is Rami. My very own Rami Discovery. Did you know you'll be happy forever and ever if you got one of these clovers? So I gave my papa one. He said, oh, Rami, thank you so much. He was so happy. So, Princess, I think you should give one of these to your papa, too. Got a happy clover. A girl in Cast Town gave you this four-leaf plant. You should take it to the King of Hyrule. Now go make your papa happy, too. Ah, puppers, wait! Oh, I saw the thing on, the, on his helmet. I thought it was an exclamation mark for a side quest. Ah, Zelda, how good to see you. You... you have something for me. Oh. Ah, I see, and for one of the young children in town. A clover that brings happiness. Sounds like she's found a real treasure then, hasn't she? You said the child's name was Rami? Well, then I'll have to find a way to show her my gratitude. Oh. Your Majesty, urgent news! <clears throat> what is it? A young child from town, little Rami, has run away, slipped out into the field. By the time the guards noticed her, she'd already bolted out the southern gate. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. Gather your fellow soldiers at the southern gate. We must send out a search party immediately. Yes, sir. Rami, that was a child who wanted me to have this clover, was it not? I know there's still much you need to do, Zelda, but would you assist us in the search effort? I am terribly concerned about all this. That soldier said Rami ran through the southern gate. The guards there should be able to tell you more. So it is more uh, complex than just bring him the clover. Hmm. Something else? Is that a fairy following you? No, I'm Try, and it talks. How strange. I don't see anything around here that looks like it would be. Maybe I talk to the cat and the cat gives me something. You got an enticing bird figure over there. There's a wind that blows it from below. I'm the only one he seems to have noticed. Maybe I need wind for it. Nothing happens, okay. Maybe I do this. Aha! I was right. Thank you, kitty cat. Nice. Dirty. Cool. There's more? Oh, you have a quest. Okay. Zoles, Zoles, Zoles. Oh. Hi, Miss Princess Lady. I got a question. Have you ever seen a Zole? They're small little monsters you can find all around here. I saw a picture in the encyclopedia from my dad. Zoles are round and wiggly and so super cute. Isn't it kind of weird that monsters can be cute? Well, I've only seen them in pictures, so I don't know. Maybe they're scary in real life. But I can't stop thinking about Zoles. Uh, maybe if I could look at a Zole, I'd stop thinking about Zoles. Zoles, Zoles, Zoles. There it is! Uh, there it is! That's one! That's all. It looks just like the picture in my encyclopedia. Oh, that wiggly body, those big round eyes, it's so adorable. I just knew it'd be cute, even though it's almost, even though it's also a monster. Thanks, Miss Princess Lady. Oh, and did you know there's all different kinds of zoles? Even zoles that are like candles. It might be cool to see one of those too. I have one of those, and I use one of those a lot. There it is! That's one! Oh my gosh, an Ignazol! It's totally different from the green Zol. It looks like a candle. But it's really hot. Wow. I think I'm gonna melt. Can people melt? Big flame. Yipes. 
I know Zoles are monsters, but they're such interesting monsters. Thanks, Miss Princess Lady. Now I like Zoles even more. Whew, after all that talking, I think I need a glass of water. Oh, that reminds me. Have you heard of Hydro Zoles? There are Zoles that get bigger when wet. My mama said she used to see them. Do you think maybe you could show me a, a Hydro Zole? A big one that's full of water? What is that? Whoa. It's a hydrazol! Mm -hmm. But it looks way smaller than the one in my encyclopedia. Be fine, Miss Princess. I really like it to be cool with. I see a bigger hydrazol. You're a bastard. I was trying to make it big. And then you were like, no, that's fucking stupid. I don't want to see a stupid hydrazol. I want to see a cool hydrazol. There. There it is, that's one! Wow, that one's huge! It's bigger than my bed! You know, there are many kinds of zoles, and they're all so different. Some lighted by candles, some get in water, and they go big like whoop! I want, what I want to know is, how did the same thing become so many different things? God, I know they're monsters, but they're really interesting and fascinating and cool. Anyway, thank you, Miss Princess Lady. I like zoles even more now. Here's a good thing my papa gave me. Ooh, nice. Got a mic crystal. You know, all the zoles you brought are ones that show up in my encyclopedia. But I bet there's a zole out there my encyclopedia doesn't know about. I can't think what it looked like, though. Not right away. Right now, anyway. If I think of another zole, though, I'll be sure to ask you to show it to me. Hi. I mean, technically. Oh, no, he's scared of that one, though. Oh, so you get Miss Princess Lady. Hey, I've thought up a Zole no one's ever seen before. All the Zoles you showed me up to now are really cute, but there's gotta be a Zole that's really out there, and I mean like cute and flashy. If you ever find an out there Zole, show it to me. There's gotta be a cute and flashy one. Actually, there it is. That's one. Whoa, it sparkles. This one's not even in my encyclopedia. Where'd you find it? You're saying a person made it? I guess they must know even more about Zoles than I do. Thanks a bunch, princess. I'm gonna pay you back with my treasure. Take care of it, okay? Art piece, hell yeah. Oh shit, that, that's another heart container. When I grow up, I'm gonna study lots and lots about Zoles. I'll make friends with Zoles all over Hyrule and become a Zole expert. Oh, three hearts and a little bit of energy. Course, blue and red. Okay. That makes sense. I didn't. So far, it doesn't seem like there's any uh, more side quests nearby, but. that go see that god damn I'm stuck on the dog maybe if I use the knockback no I'm just I'm just stuck 
I just want to see what was inside this tent. <laughs> and the game was like, no, fuck you. You don't get to see what's inside the tent and leave. We're honored to have your help, Princess Zelda. The child was seen running along on the road past the gate. We think she was chasing a dog. We've dispatched soldiers to comb along the road. You can ask if, you, if they've seen anything. Hmm, no sign of the child or the dog around here. Must have headed further south. It's inspiring to see you join us in the search effort, your highness. We'll follow along this road towards Jabal Waters. Would you like to check the road heading west? Thank you so much for your assistance, Princess Zelda. I'll search from here to the southern prairie. If you would, please search elsewhere to spread out. Thirty-two. Princess, terrible news. A new rift has sprung up just ahead. We're still investing in the scene, so please be careful if you decide to move closer. So there has. Where is that? Have I been? I don't know if I've been there. Ah, Princess Zelda, you're here. We came upon this roof while searching for the missing child, but this dog won't move an inch. It refuses to leave. And if this is Romy's dog, then that could mean... Oh, I can't even bear to say it. I can create an entrance here. Stand back, Zelda. Oh, yep, there she is. I can sense my friends here, they're trapped. They're trapped in three areas to be exact. The risk of them all, we can fix this rift. That's the girl who went missing, isn't it, Romy? We found her. If we mend the rift, we'll be able to save her. It is a little surprising we haven't fought a Moldorm yet, like, like a full-sized one. thing. I only saw the thumbnail for it, but the, the thumbnail was like, here's how you get this, the super awesome Lionel early in Echoes of Wisdom, and I'm like, you yeah, know, that's cool. And you can get it early, but you can't fucking use it till, like, you're like two-thirds at least of the way through the game. We found all my friends in this area. Now we can mend this rift.
My friends share some of their power with me. Oh, so close. There's gotta be one rift left. You got two mic crystals from Try. So let's go back to your world now. Okay. So I'm assuming there's only six more uh, mic crystals. Not entirely sure on that, but I, I, I think. Ah, Princess Elves, the miracle! The rift is gone and the child is saved! Oh, it's the princess! Hi, princess! Um, why are you here? You were caught in a rift. Princess Zelda saved you from it. Oh, wow! Thank you! I guess that means it, it's been a while, huh? We should probably go home. Thank you for your help, your highness. If you hadn't been here, well, I'm just glad you were. I'll go brief the other soldiers on what happened. Will you escort this one to the castle? I played lots and lots, now I'm hungry. Oh. Thank you for helping for helping to bring back my dear daughter. When I heard she slipped out of town, I didn't know what to do. Thankfully, little Romy is safe now because of Princess Zelda. I too am relieved to have the child back with us. Mm. Romy? Glad as we are that you're sa that you're safe, you should know your father was very worried. In the future, you mustn't go beyond the gates on your own, understood? Papa was worried about me? I'm sorry, I'll be more careful. I also want you to know that Zelda gave me your gift. And I'd like to take the opportunity to express my gratitude. Thank you, Romy. I will cherish it. Now, I'm sure you're both tired after all the excitement today. This soldier will escort you back into town. Yes, your majesty. Bye-bye, king. Bye-bye, princess. Hmm. <laughs> hey, Romy, slow down. Zelda, I appreciate your help with this matter. You know, you're actually, you actually caused a similar fuss once when you were little. You always were a spirited one. I used to worry terribly when you got into trouble, and now, now you're grown up so much so that you're no, you no longer need my help. Even so, Zelda, you will always be my daughter, no matter how strong and capable you become, and no matter the duties you are burdened with. Here, I'd like you to have this dress back. Got some customary attire. This beautiful and elegant dress is fit for a princess. Wearing it makes you feel regal. Is that the clothes from the beginning of the game? You left it with Impo when you fled the castle, yes? It is. This dr that dress is a symbol of who you are to this kingdom and who you are <coughs> who you are to me. The princess of Hyrule, my beloved daughter. <coughs> you are my greatest treasure, Zelda. While you are away, I will wish for your safety upon this happy clover. Please know that you may return home whenever you need rest. Are there any like special like effects to this or? Right, it makes you feel real. Yeah, it's my clothes from the beginning of the game. That's cool. But the silk pajamas just have the effect of the silk pajamas is so nice. And the only other uh, clothes that have any real benefit, it seems, are the cat clothes. And the cat clothes look stupid, and these look not stupid. There's still some more around here, huh? Over here? No. Is it on top of the castle, maybe? I can't build them up any higher than that, huh? Why? Oh, because they're ice blocks. Oh, here it is, yeah. On top of the castle. Got a mic crystal. You can even use it. You can use it for enhancement. Loot Berry's home. 35. Man, we're so close to done. That's too far. 
And then maybe outside the, the town? Here? Maybe here. No. No, it's over here. I'm assuming I need the whole mill. Maybe it's under the bridge. No. I... Glass over here. It's more when I get over here. Okay. It's something to do with the bridge, or the, the area around the bridge. Oh. Flashing real fast here. Maybe it's under here? No. Like hit a tree, do I? That's like above me. Oh, there's a there's a height limit. Okay. It's not right here. Fucking stupid acorn gathering. Shit. <laughs> of course it's acorn gathering. I didn't even think to talk to the dude. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, there's ten. I missed one. Okay. pretty easy. Oh. 
Nice work, you got all the acorns. And your time was 13.18. You are amazing. Alright, then it's prize time. 20 rupees. Wow, that was lightning fast. So fast, in fact, that you deserve it. You get the special one-time bonus. Cool. Three. Ooh. So there might only be two more, then. So I think... Oh, right, I need to go to Southern... Southern Village. I can just do this to get there. Uh, so, so, here, Southern Village. Oh. And I need to do uh, smoothies as well. And I need to find out how to get more hard pieces too. <laughs> I almost crashed like out of the snowball. Whoa, is this snow? That's amazing! Thanks for bringing it, miss. Okay, if I touch it, it'll break. Yeah, it's so cold, and it's fluffy and crunchy. But if I pack this stuff in my head, it's solid? Weird. Ugh, I got some in my mouth. Ah, oh, gotta stop, my hands are freezing. Yeah, that was fun! Hold out your hand, miss. Mom said I gotta thank anyone who helps me with things. Now that was the best. I hope it snows in Southern Village someday. Hmm. Ah, oh, my eye. Okay, it might be something new I can do. Oh, that was in Kakariko, not here. It might be something new I can do in Kakariko. Where's Kakariko? Kakariko's right here. I actually went to the exact right one, and then I was like, wait a minute, no, this isn't right. It was right, I'm just dumb. That's all. There might be a new quest here, but I doubt it. Here, we got rid of that rift in the crater of the volcano. Hopefully, that means that we'll have more gorons visit us down here. Maybe right here. There you are. There we go, cool. That's 39. Here's where I'm going to go to the Kakariko Dojo. Waiting for you, mighty slumber. Looks like you had a few more experiences with us, met. That means new training. Surely you have slept far, <laughs> young one. Care to do some training and work to close your inner eyes? I am ready. Huzzah, here's our menu of dream options. Oh shit, there's so many. Alright, floating on fire. Yes. Your training begins now. I actually didn't see what all we could and couldn't have. Feel your energy flowing within you? 
Shouldn't you have to rely on your skills alone and we'll use drinks. Right? Okay. I missed two minutes, ten seconds. Okay. Wrong one. Nice. Ow. I think I can just kinda... Ah, whoops, didn't mean to do that. Fire keys. There we go. Cool. Was that fat enough, fast enough to get me the super fast? That's even faster than the gold time I gave you. That was great slumbering. Let me give you a reward. Cool. And speed like that makes you quite the power napper. Performing like that deserves a special reward. A uh, rock tato, hell yeah. Mm. Eugene being advanced to notice that level. Training is like a whetstone of sleep. As promised, I've got astounding I got something astounding for you in recognition of your sleepy progress. Second mastery is cool. Really slowly energy loss. Okay, cool. Just three more times. An astounding reward. Okay, I want that then. Um Don't need that. I want this. Honestly, for now, I could probably even equip that as well. <laughs> I am ready. What do we got? Blank Sleep Battle. Ice? Yeah, sure, it seems like it's more interesting than Revenge in the Sky. <coughs> I put interesting lightly. <laughs> All you have is your rod. Want my rod and try. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, we're in this room. Okay, I remember this room. God. No, stop. I was really hoping that would uh, crush him, but I guess not. Huh? I want him. Give me him. Give me him. Thank you. Really? I'm just gonna restart. That guy was so sloppy to fight. <sighs> Gotta be on the fucking ice too, huh? I'm actually in my pajamas this time, so 
I'm even more ready for this. Right, I can't jump very high. No, him. There we. Go. No. So many games like here. Let me. Let, let, how about you target literally everything except for the thing you want to target? No! I didn't mean to do that. No, I don't want the fucking ice block. I want the guy. The guy. Thank you. That was slow. I mean, it was still faster than his time, but it was still slow by my standards. Yeah, see, it wasn't even uh, a power nap or whatever. It's fine. Okay, let's knock this one out so that way we can be done with the blank slate battles. What? Two minutes. Okay, there's so much bullshit here. What? Why is there? Pick up the rock. Pick up the rock. Jesus Christ, why won't you die? How much fucking health do you have? Oh my god, you have so much fucking health. This guy's still fucking there. And I died. Yeah, this one's gonna be kinda awful, huh? Yeah. 
I think I still want to try to take out the keys right away. Immediately grab the rock echo. I, what the fuck, stupid. No, I want to hit the keys. Thank you. Give me that. Okay, I have new plan. Is it a good plan? No. But it's a plan. I want to take out the Deku Baba right away, and the Deku Baba can help me take out all the shit. All, all the, uh, all the bullshit. Really already? Cause I think dead now. Yes, good. Shit. Can you hit him, please? Thank you. And this thing, I can probably just kill it with the Deku Bala. Or not. There's no more rocks. Crap. Take out that bastard. Maybe if I use the um the plant. I, I think obviously I, I think the Deku Baba is the way to go. Grab that right away.
one right here, take care of that guy. And then, you know what? Shit, fuck, it's right. Crap. Never mind, it's not gonna work then. No, not not him. Okay, how expensive is the plant? I don't have its uh, echo yet. Four. Okay. It is way too fucking slow. There we go. Okay, so it's the Octorox. It, it can't kill the Octorox, so that's good. Okay. It's even faster than the gold time I gave you. That was great slumbering. Let me give you a reward. Oh, golden egg. Thank you. Three gold eggs, actually. Really have slept far, young one. <laughs> Revenge from the skies. I can do this. If I need just to use a bunch of bats, I can. Or a bunch of keys, but... I might just be able to use a Lionel. Ooh! Forest Temple Lobby. I cannot just use a bunch of, uh... A bunch of keys, but... Oh, that was it. Cool. Yeah, the Lionel just trivializes everything. Lickety split, you're even faster than the gold time. Great slumbering. Hey, I got a Twisted Pumpkin. I ate them, actually. I got Power Napper, and I got some Cactus. Ah, cool, a heart piece. Three more trainings, huh? Did I get another reward? How many do we have left here? Three. Trial of Flame and Ice. Um. This might be really easy. <laughs> Again, the Lionel just trivializes everything. Oh, the great slumbering. Let me give you a reward. Nice. Ooh, rock salt. Thank you. I am ready. Next is... One that doesn't sound like it's going to be any fun, but whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Two and a half minutes to fight three wiz robes, which does make sense, but...
Whoops, didn't mean that. Oh. H how long was that? 17 seconds? We had two and a half minutes to do it? <laughs> we got 50 rupees. Nice. Thank you. We got monster guts. Seven monster guts. Nice. I have one more training. I don't know if it's just the last three bosses or if it's all six bosses or more or what, but yeah. 10 minutes, 45 seconds. I'm assuming this is just the the last three bosses. And if that's the case, it shouldn't be too bad, really. This will be available. Fight with everything. I forgot I can't make that jump. Where is... I don't think there's a... I was gonna say, I wonder if there is a level 3 spear mob and I just don't have it yet. I need the spear mobbins then. I probably passed him. Yeah, right here. I'm using a lot of sword energy, so I gotta be careful, but yeah. Hitting Glovega with Lionel is rather difficult. Ow. Rude. Twice? <laughs> Damn it. Bass is so much health. for a uh, Lionel attack now. 
No, I don't like a, a, get a green ball. Oh, cool. I fell in love with Lionel killed her. Good job, Lionel. Proud of you. That fight took me almost three minutes. I think I remember what the trick was for this boss fight. It was that, and then it was one of these buzz blobs or whatever. I guess a sparkle work too. That's ice, I want water. Actually, if I do that over here, then maybe this will work better. Excuse Put the water. And then put the fucking buzz blob. In the- w Oh my god. Lionel. Why are you aiming at that? I can't. Maybe if I... I think I want... Drop that, take... This. Okay, this is nothing, so I need, uh, electricity, I guess. Where's the buzz blob? Where's the fucking buzz blob? There you are. Has now. Actually, these might work too. Or not, because you can't fucking hit it apparently. Can't move. And I want to drink a smoothie as well to get my hearts back. Uh, didn't I have one that restores like... That's fine, whatever. That's good.
Okay, and then at Lionel again. Ow, rude. There we go. And we have just over four minutes to fight. Uh, what's his name? Burn freeze guy. Scorch Hill. Right, Scorch Hill. No, I don't want to stop training. I want to... He's in ice right now, so I want fire keys. Or fire wizard will work too. Fire wizard is probably stronger. Great, right into his butt, huh? Okay, now I want uh, Lionel. Jesus Christ, I just go so far to get to Lionel. Get up! Phase two. Now I'm gonna want an ice wizard. Robe. Very, very quick. It's so easy to just get the line from here. Honestly, I think it's faster to just spam, or just to throw out our new Lionel every couple of seconds and just to let the Lionel go through like all its attacks and stuff. Why are you targeting the pot? There you go, thank you. There we go, cool. Honestly, Volvagia was the worst part of that fight. Crazy they brought Volvagia back as the boss, though. Finished, yay. Oh, well done, only 7.54.12. That's even faster than the goal time I gave you. That was great slumbering, let me give you a reward. Cool, we got the monster stone. And we get a uh, power napper. And speed like that means you quit the power napper. Performs like that, but deserves a special reward. Milk, yay. Mm. Ah, you dreamed big and advanced to another level. Training is like the whetstone of sleep. Well, I got something astounding for you, for you in recognition of your sleepy progress. The final mastery. Cool. Uh, through everything I've thrown at you, congratulations. When I think of how much you've grown since you first walked in here, I think it's time. One final training. I'll get it ready. You should get yourself ready. It's going to be real hard. I don't doubt it. Let's see this final mastery. Energy consumption reduced level 3. I can have level two, 3 and level 2 on. You are now the ultimate snorier. That said, care to do some more training anyway? I am ready. The final Titans gathering. Oh, all the bosses. Okay, cool. Your training begins now. Well, I have the uh, the Lionel, so it should be easy. Your material possessions will be available. Fight with everything. Fifteen fifty. Ow. 
Why do I not have Lionel? Actually, you know what? Yeah, I'll do this. Uh, take off the rupees and give me that one. Oh, yes, now I lose like almost none. <laughs> nice. That just cut him immediately into uh, the next phase. He angry now. I said, come, fucking come on. There we go, 36 seconds for the first boss. Not bad. There we go, now it's in move. Oh right, fish. The the fish is next. Uh, I can go with. Where is it? Chompfin. I need to equip the faster swimming. Uh, I don't need that. Give me this. Shit. I'm still not excited for the, for the Volvagia rematch, though. Because that one's just rough. I don't really have anything that can... I have a couple and uh, Echoes that can withstand lava, but none of them are very good. Actually, my Echoes that can withstand lava, how much do they cost? Off the top of my head, it's really only just... Oh! You cost one. Okay. Anyway, I need, uh, boulders. Why aren't boulders up close to the front? Yeah. Oh, I need jumping in. I don't need jumping, but it, I, I want jumping again. Red Lionel. Phase two. Right, San Tornado's now. broke my fucking boulder.
He's doing tornadoes now. Okay, gotcha. There we go. 315 for the first three bosses. Now we have... Are we fighting Ganon or are we fighting the other temple bosses? If we're fighting Ganon, that would be a problem. Okay, we're fighting the other temple bosses. Cool. Ah, shit. Mm. I mean, it's still trying. Okay, they're gonna go in the lava, or is it gonna... They're gonna go, come out on the holes again. I don't remember. Just in case, I'm gonna grab the uh, spear moblins. Lava, okay. Just in case I'll have the fast to do it like this. Line already. Just in case. I'm probably gonna need um, spears again. Oh no, we're here now. Okay. going in the middle now, so I need, uh, spears, um, down, no, up, because it's all messed up, because, yeah, here, uh, here, spears, ah, I fell in the fucking lava, god damn it, I fell in lava again, I thought I was safe, but I guess not. Can you stop? There we go. Okay, we have nine minutes to fight the last two bosses. We're fine. We are okie dokie.
Okay, good. We're in phase two now, it's cool. Give me the buzz bobs. Give me the uh, Lionel again. Actually, I do want to do it on the Lionel so I can destroy the uh, the eggs and stuff. One more fight, and we actually made that fight really quick. So, like the the next fight, uh, score chill. Uh, fire wizard, 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 wizard. Uh, did I pass them? Here they are. Switch to Lionel. Oh, Lionel's okay. Okay, phase two. I don't know how much energy we have left. Just not much, but yeah, not much at all. Fuck am I? There I am. Okay, phase three. Phase three is fine. Kinda cool, the uh the floor actually gets higher when uh when it enters the ice phase. Finish it off, Lionel. There we go. Cool, we had over six minutes left. Cool. That should be power nap. I don't know if we even get a power nap reward for this one. Probably. Because this is the last one, so. Oh, supposedly. Oh, uh, shit. That's not good. That's really not good.
need the uh Ah, uh, it doesn't give me energy, huh? Fantastic. This is where the problem comes in, because I don't have any energy. And these guys aren't dropping the energy that they usually do. some more. Milk sm milky smoothie. Yeah, that sounds kind of gross. Makes it like a chunky smoothie or something. Okay, so the trident immediately despawns them then. Okay. There we go. Cool. And that should be that then, right? That's that, right? Good. <laughs> I didn't think there was another paddle, but... Only 12.51.38. That's even faster than the goal time I gave you. You've reached the end of the slumber's path. I have no more dreams for you. As a little graduation present, take this handy dandy outfit. Okay. And speed like that makes you quite the power napper. Oh. I was hoping you'd give me like a, a, a full heart container or something. You are now a master of the slumber dojo. The ultimate snorier. But you will, al you will always be a precious student and... I can't talk. But you will always be my precious student and more than welcome here. Nice. <laughs> now really is the Legend of Zelda. Or I guess the Legend of Link? I don't know. <laughs> Zelda's the hero, right? <laughs> he, he, Zelda's the one dressed in green, right? <laughs> Nice. Um, what now? I know I have to go to the forest. I don't want to go to the forest yet. 
There's still so much I need to do. I have... I think, like... Seven heart pieces left. I need one more Might Crystal and I can upgrade both my bow and my bombs. And I still have, like... Four stamps left? Five stamps left. I don't know where any of them are. They might be a couple by, uh... Up on the mountain again. So I should go back there, really. Um... Okay, let's warp to over here. I'm assuming this is the right place to go. I think it is. This is... Lootberry's place, right? I hope. I mean, it's not a big deal if it's not, but... I think this is the correct warp. Yes. <clears throat> uh, I guess my bow, because I use it slightly more often. It's not like I'm very far from upgrading the bombs to full two. Fancy. Might bow, bow of Might is now level 3. That's actually it for now. I can't upgrade anything else. Any, there's one more Might Crystal. I'm so close to the end. Ow, my foot. Uh, do I need more fairies? No. Alright, I want to go to the top of the mountain. Uh... This is Holy Mountain Lanary, right? Or close to it, I think. No, this is Hebra Mountain. But it's also where the thing is to go to Holy Mountain Lanary. So, I don't know. Oh, there's a rift over there. That's going to get us up to level 11. Oh, cold. Can I warp to... I can warp to here. That can take us there. Oh, my back. That'd be really cool if this rift had, uh... Had his brother in it. I mean, we could save his brother, but... Who knows? Definitely not me. Who'd put a stamp stand on Hebrew Mountain of all places? Me! Who else? It'd be truly uplifting to plunk a stamp in this place with all its silvery snow, but now... My stamp stand's been swallowed up. Did that dark stuff really want to plunk that badly? You can't have this place all to yourself, dark stuff. Spit it out! Uh, it's too cold for this, but I'd really like to have my stamp stand back again. Alright, let's go get a stamp back. Maybe he'll give me a heart piece or something. <coughs> I really have no clue what else we can do for, uh... I can sense my friends here. They're trapped. Ow, my leg. They're trapped in three years, to be exact. If we rescue them all, we can fix this rift. Uh... I guess I can just use clouds. That works. Get him. That's not the right enemy, but okay. Get him. Oh, you don't break the ice, huh? Alright. Oh. 
Okay, that doesn't work. <laughs> it melts some of the ice, which is cool, but... He still needs to die. Thank you, Lionel. And no, I don't think that just a stamp is enough of a reward. I see, I see, I see the cloud there. the stamp stand. Oh, of course it's sideways. Oh, it's not... It's not dead... death water. Okay, can I push that from under here? No. I have to go this way, I guess. Ugh, I can't remember. Where's my shark? Where's my shark? Shark! Sharky shoe! Yeah, eat him. Right, I have to... Should be the last rift too. Finally, my friends in this area. Now we can mend this rift. There might still be one rift uh, to like actually fight Void, but I don't know. It feels like going to the Eternal Forest would be the final dungeon, so. Yeah. You don't usually get a heart container at the final dungeon. My friends share some of their power with me. Amazing. I feel like I can do even more now. <gasps> Vinyl went down, really? Oh, all my... I only have two sixes, but still... No, I only have one six. So yeah, Lionel went down. That's cool. So I can do Lionel and then another enemy. That's cool. That's the last one I expected. Two, 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 two. Why two? Why? Why two? Why do we have leftovers? Hmm. I don't like that. And now I'm seeing things. My my poor stamp stand before tragedy struck. I'm not even dressed right. No sleeves is a rally look. Not an I'm ruined look. It's you again. Uh, wait. The dark stuff. It's gone. My stand is really back. Did you do this? Thank you. You went into a world of trouble. But I get it. I'd do anything. Bet I'd do anything to help out stamp fans too. And stamp fans know. You've got to step up there and get your stamp plunked. My stamp stand here in Hebrew Mountain is fine again. No need to stick around. But before I go, a little dance for you. Ready, set, go stamp rally. I'm going to kill that bastard. The only good thing about him is the JoJo poses he makes in his uh, stamps. Oh, that's... uh. That's the height limit, okay. Cool. Yeah, so I take it that's everything I can do here then. 
Maybe there's something at uh, his house. If you're wondering why I'm not saying his name, it's because I don't remember his name already. <laughs> I like him as a character. I like what he represents as a character, but I don't remember his name at all. He's here. He does have a side quest. Cool. Conde! Zelda, try it. You came to play with Conde. Do you two have a little time to chat? Conde remembered something after we talked about Big Brother the other day. Oh, what? Tell us. A long time ago, Big Brother did some magic that changed the weather for a day. The magic made it sunny so we could fly off safely in his hot air balloon. That got Conde thinking. Big Brother would have an easier time coming home if Hebrew Mountain was sunny again. Conde plans to do that same magic. I bet that'd make your brother happy. How does it work? You need to bring a snowball that glitters like the sun to a specific spot in Hebrew Mountain. You have to carry the snowball carefully, it doesn't break. It has to be perfectly round. But that's so difficult, Conde breaks it every single time. Zelda, could you show Conde how to do the snowball magic right? Conde might be able to do it after seeing you do it right. Thanks for coming with Conde. We're finally at the special spot. The glittering snowballs Conde told you about are rolling around in this area. Conde needs you to carry a snowball to the pedestal in the northwest. You'll do this magic right if you place a snowball on top of the pedestal. Conde messes up lots of times. Maybe you'll figure it out, Zelda. Please show Conde how to do it. Ow. Do I just place a snowball echo on top of it, or do I actually actually have to carry a snowball? Ow! I think I actually have to carry a snowball, okay. Unless this thing is a sn no. Ow, wrong way. Ow. Ow! Ah! Good thing there's so much defense, that's cool. Why could I walk through it? Sorry, I can't pick it up. Conde, I don't understand. How do I... Snowball. Oh, I'm stupid. Ow. Yeah, these ones don't sparkle like the sun. No. I had a bad angle too. Oh good, they don't break if they touch something, that's really good. Ow. <laughs> well, it worked. That was amazing, Zelda, the magic worked. Now that you've done it, Conde can probably do it right. Can probably do it right too. In fact, Conde, sure he can. Thank you, Conde. Wants you to have this reward. Yeah, another piece of heart. Conde used to play here with Big Brother. The view is great for watching the weather. 
kind of forgot about that magic for a while, but now we'll do it for Big Brother every day. Thanks, Zelda. You too, try. You can bet that Kondo will keep doing his very best. Awesome. Thank you, Kondo. Oh, this one doesn't glitter like the sun. That one's gross and ugly. And... Kondo's not still here, right? No. Let's head back to Conde's house. Maybe he's got something new for us. To, where the where is Conde's house? Right here. Some of you guys couldn't see Conde's house. Ow, my head. Ow. My head hurts a little bit. No new quest for Conde. So the clothes you're wearing. Conde has seen them before. Conde once fell in, into some of that dark gunk that, and was saved by someone who wore that. Conde can't remember much about it, but the sight of you and that makes Conde happy. Oh, there's unique dialogue for this, these clothes. Okay, let's go see uh, Southern Village and see if they have anything unique to say about my clothes. Maybe a side quest. I don't know. Probably not. Thanks, throwing that snow, miss. I really hope that snow falls in this village someday. If it does, come back to play. Yeah. <sighs> Lincoln Charles, mind passing on a message? Tell him we're all eager to see him come back home to Southern Village when he can. Okay. Is this the house that I suspected is Lynx? Yeah. Thanks, yeah. I'll admit earlier, my wife and I are going to give us a good trip. Good thought into where we're gonna, going on our trip. I can't say I wish I'd rather village. So many places I'd rather... Okay. I don't think I've really gone looking for side quests in, um, in the River Zora place. Cause I feel like that's where most of my heart pieces are going to be now, are in, uh, side quests. You have an underwater spot too, but... I need to, uh... Go see Blueberry too. So I have 21 now. Oh, I don't have the thing on. Right. Uh, well I don't need all th I don't have all three of them on. Uh, give me... This. Okay, so far it doesn't seem like there's more side quests here. Like, we did one other side quest out here, but that was... Started in the Caesar place. I mean, I can always go back and see the Caesar, see if there's anything new for me. Oh, right, and they fixed the bridges, too. Right. Okay, cave I've been to. I wanted to go down there. That's where I wanted to go. Right.
Wait. A cave I haven't been in before. Interesting. Do not disturb the bomb fish. Danger, do not proceed past this point. Ow. 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 Okay, um. Jump there, but all right. Hmm. fish, huh? I'm stuck! I'm stuck! We're fine. I didn't realize I could have just thrown a bomb fish at them, but cool. Good to know. How's my air? I need more. this one. Maybe a table and a torch? Oh wait, bombfish, bombfish, bombfish. Uh can the bombfish even get up there? Oh, wait, 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 table bombfish. for a golden egg and no heart heart piece disappointing <sighs> whatever <laughs>
Right, this area is probably swallowed by the rift, so. Okay, one more and we get another heart, and then there's four left, I assume. You don't have a a thing for me. He seems happy and content. Cool. Oh, that's it, huh? Okay. Maybe. Oh, shit. Maybe he wants a fish. Well, there goes my awkward time knowledge. <laughs> it ended up not proving to be any use. I'm thinking maybe if I give him a fish, then I will, uh, um, he'll give me a heart piece or something. Like how that's how you got into the dungeon in Ocarina, but no. Wishful thinking, I guess. That's another one. I don't know why we're getting more. I'm gonna check over here and then I'm gonna go see Blueberry. And see what else is new. Probably stuff over here I haven't checked out yet. Like a stamp! Uh, where is... Ooh, heart, heart piece, yes please! There you go, that is 19 out of 20 hearts. Is I assume 20 is my max. I have no reason to think otherwise. I'm glad I went over there. Ooh, chest. Okay, cool. Uh, honestly, the smoothie uh, slide quest probably gets me a heart piece. So I should probably knock that off pretty soon. Okay. Um, Blueberry's house. Alright. Ow, I just popped my fucking leg. Oh, that hurt. Oh. Oh, that hurt actually a lot. My bombs. Sure thing, leave it to me. Okay, what do the bombs look like now? Ooh, they're extra detailed. Bombs are mine at level 3. That's it, nothing more I can enhance for you. But if you bring 25 of my crystals, I'll make something I, li I think you'll like. 25, huh? 25? I have like two. Maybe three. I have two. Okay. So there's 23 more. So 
around. Where do I want to go now? to a smoothie shop. There's one right here. You can get some new recipes. Smoothie, please. I haven't done two bubble kelps, okay. Ah, oh, my eye. You're a smoothie. Got a bubble smoothie. Okay. So I just gotta slowly work through until I get every combination. Maybe. I don't know. Didn't like that. Okay. Whoops, I said, actually said no. I'm gonna tea. Uh, oh, I got water over there, though. Oh, hi, Bella. I see you over there. Hey, baby girl. She's hiding behind the blanket on my bed. You're smoothie. A milky... Uh. So sad again. Let's see drinks. Gotta make some face first. I can sell my drinks. Okay, cool. Hi, Bella. Hi, baby. You're a good girl. Oh, there you go, baby. Hey, sweetheart. Oh, you're out of water. Here, let me get some water. She probably saw me grab my water bottle and wanted water. Watch your head. There you go. Tons of water for you, baby. Hi. Hi. <laughs> She's looking at me like... Thanks, I guess? <laughs> yeah. Hi, baby. Glow is not really that useful, honestly. How much do the golden eggs sell for? Oh, wow, 150 each. 4,000 rupees, wow. I'm not gonna do that, but okay. Now I get to make some more smoothies. Rock-tato. 
I wouldn't be surprised if this one ends up unfortunate. Oh, no, it doesn't. Uh, mixed bowl smoothie, okay. Oh, I have the, the salt one, okay. Oh! A radiant smoothie, okay, cool. Oh, right, yeah, the kelp is... Okay, kelp is breath. Okay. What are you doing, Bella? You're just looking at your water. You weren't even drinking, you were just looking at it. <coughs> Hi, baby. I love you, big girl. You're a good girl. Come here. Bella, come here. She doesn't care. She doesn't care. <laughs> uh, pumpkin bubble smoothie. Oh, nice. I didn't think that would work. She does giving love bites, but doesn't understand that when she gives a love bite, she needs to do it gently. <laughs> it always hurts. I love you, silly cat. She got sharp teethies. <laughs> Hi, baby. Hi, baby. I don't know she's just trying to bite me because she's telling me to fuck off. That could be the case, too. A bubble potion. Nice. And then one more. Bubble kelp plus golden egg. We'll make a golden bubble potion or something? I don't know. Oh! Golden bubble smoothie. Okay. Nice. Ow. Now, river horse recipes. We don't need to do that because we've done that. River horse plus river horse. Ah, chair. This chair hates me. <laughs> and I hate it. it. It works. But, like, I never really showed it off, but the back piece actually kind of isn't connected anymore. So it's just staying there by the fact that I'm sitting here. <laughs> and I'm not going to go without it because it would be really uh, uncomfortable. I don't know how close we are to full yet, so. Ooh, a mixed apple smoothie. That looks tasty. River horse and warm pepper. Probably, I wouldn't be surprised if it ended up as unfortunate, but. Hi, baby. Oh, no. A rapid smoothie. Oh, no, a milk smoothie. That sounds gross. A milky rapid smoothie. Oh, no. How many recipes do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 22. And we need 30, I think it was? Bella, you're so pretty, baby. Ooh, a cactus smoothie. That one might be new, actually. I'm not sure. I have enough ingredients to uh, to do all these. It's just they take so long. They only take a few seconds each, but like still. Kind of interesting that so many recipes just make the same thing. Ugh. 
It's a little disappointing they're not unique, but... Or they're not all unique, but whatever. You got too many drinks. Go make some space first. So. Can I sell multiple? No. I have to sell them individually. They're pretty quick, though, so... I'm actually making money through this, so that's cool. More smoothies. Oh, <laughs> I got an unfortunate. Still the best name for a drink I've ever seen. An unfortunate smoothie. <laughs> That's fancy. A mixed twisty smoothie. I like that one a lot. Hmm. Yeah, not very many things mixed with monster guts. I I'm assuming it's probably like only for potions, but I don't know. No, because the Heat resist potion uses fangs, I think. So I have no clue. Oh, it's probably just one of the two manja parts that uses fangs, so. I don't know if there's really consistency between, uh. Um. Which monster part you need for the potion. Golden Rapid Smoothie. Now one of the grapes. Cool. Man, I fucking love grapes. Sometimes they give me heartburn though, and they're not fun. I gotta eat a couple grapes. A warm mix. Nice. I eat a couple of grapes and my heart feels like it's trying to burst out of my chest. It feels like I'm having a, far a fucking heart attack. It hurts. Every time. I pray there's something that runs in the family because my mom gets those kind of that kind of heartburn too. A refreshing milky smoothie. Ew. Oh man, grapes are so good. We bought these, uh, my mom bought these grapes from Costco, I think. They were kind of pricey, but they're called cotton candy grapes, and they legitimately just tasted like cotton candy. They were so fucking good. I like grapes. Grapes are good. Grapes are really good. Ooh, I like that one. A mixed climbing smoothie. But like, they actually tasted like just candy. They were so fucking good. So I'm assuming there's not an ingredient that I missed, but who knows. There is because they're too- Grapes are pretty fucking pricey. But they're so good though. <laughs> Great, they, they taste so good. Okay. The same one as before. Gotcha. Oh, too many drinks. We have a lot of these healing smoothies, so I need to actually sell some. 
This one for sure only gives five. No, thank you. This one. We need twelve dollars. Graves and be sad. I didn't say it. Absolutely, yeah. Ooh, that one's ten. Oh, that's the milky one, huh? The idea of a milky smoothie is still kind of gross. So grapes plus milk heals a lot of hearts. This golden one heals a whole shit ton. Now I just gotta finish off the with these three for grapes, and then I can move on to the apples. My mouth is so fucking dry. That is true. But if you if you were to describe a smoothie as milky, it just sounds gross. But yeah, I, I guess that is true. Smoothies do have some sort of milk product in them. Oh, okay. Grapes just... I guess grapes are for health, so... I guess you can't make a grape potion. And golden grape uh, smoothie. A golden smoothie. Fair. I'm not mistaken, five to, oh, there we go. That's 20. Good going, another strong showing from our smoothie designer. And then your customers will never run out of options. Web conversation, I'll go ahead and upgrade the, that scope we gave you before. You got server binoculars, nice. You're in a promotion. Have you ever pictured yourself in management? Maybe running your own branch, eh? Though, what if she's too good? I don't want anyone cutting into my profits. Actually, we don't have any open positions at the moment. Hope you, hope to see you back soon. Oh, is that it? Oh. Okay, we don't have, we don't have to make any more, so that's cool. That's unfortunate. It's not a um, not a heart piece. It's kind of cool, but again, I, I would have really liked a heart piece. I still need, like, four more stand- Oh, there's a... A thing near here, huh? Somewhere around here. Underneath, maybe? Oh, right here. There's another one nearby. Is it also underwater or? Didn't see this before. Seahorse smoothie? Uh, yes. Yeah, seahorse smoothie. It increases swim speed, I think. Which is ironic, because seahorses swim very slowly. The cat, want, the, cat, the cat wants to talk. Oh, you can understand me? How very unusual. It may surprise you, but I am a very I am a well traveled lady from the desert. See my friend there? I met her right here in Jabul Waters at the end of my travels. I adore her, but the fish she provides simply don't suit my palate. I don't blend them up alive. I don't know. That's a good question. So every so every day she fishes and fishes hoping to catch something I like. It's frankly adorable. Bless her giant heart. Which is why I would like to give her a treat. Where I come from, the people make a smoothie that I hear is absolutely delectable. It's called a warmix spatial, something along those lines. I'm certain if you speak with a smoothie person in the desert, they'll know what you're after. Once you have it, check in with me, then give it to my person friend. I'll reward you handsomely. Going to the desert. I think I know who I have to talk to, but...
Because there's a person in the house full of cats. Is it this one? No. It's this one over here. Over here, maybe? Oh, that's not a house. That was a window I saw. <laughs> nope, that's not a house either. Maybe this one over here? Alright, you're the one who's afraid of beetles, okay. Even thinking of them would creeps me out, though. I don't want to talk to the cat, I want to talk to the person. Huh. Have you seen someone don't in their animal before? Oh. Maybe I need to speak to the... The smoothie salesman in the desert. Unless it's you. No, it's not. There's still something around here, and I don't know how to get it. It's not in the water. I have no clue where it is. Is it in here, maybe? Torma ropes me to helping her with Mango Rush, but she shares her tough mangoes with me, so I don't mind too much. Uh, please speak me directly if you'd like to try Mango Rush. I don't want to, I just want to... What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> I know what that problem is. Streamlabs timed out Nightbot for trying to post links. Crap. Nightbot is set, up, set as a mod, though. I'm pretty sure. Oh, I thought Nightbot was already mod. Huh. Okay. Maybe I forgot to mod Nightbot, then. Oh, there we go. Now Nightbot's a mod. Okay, gotcha. So now I can re-enable link protection. Okay. Uh, sure, let's play. I've been waiting for you. They are finally ready to be witnessed. My grandest work yet. These seeds are likely more dangerous than any you've encountered thus far. But I'm sure you'll be fine. If you're ready, please try out my ultimate seeds. They should yield a larger harvest than ever. Ultimate seeds. Like ten rupees, sir. Build a post? Okay. Cool. Hopefully. And bomb flowers. Sixty or more mangoes. Hold on a second. I need to get trampolines back again. I mean, it works for you because... Oh, I need to spin into them, right? Fuck. 
Yeah, I, I know for a fact I modded uh, Streamlabs, but... This one's actually going to be hard because they're moving so fast. No! Wow, I, I messed that one up big time, huh? And when you've been assigned to this long, you expect days like this. Wow, fucking rude. There you go, 60 or more. Oh. Exquisite! I didn't expect you to pull out such a great harvest from those seeds, too. I'm very thankful to you. To honor your efforts, I've got something special for you. It'll make your spins more effortless. Got dancing outfits. Easier to move in the streets of Google. It increases your spin area. Your tough mangoes, your harvest with you as well. Eight tough mangoes. Oh. Results, we won't be need to worry about the food is uh, scarcity. I'll compile the data collected from you thus far and report back to Chief Sierra. Who else will be careful of such harvests? Ah, oh, sorry, I was lost in thought. So carried away by your incredible harvesting skills, I overlooked a crucial detail. As it'll need to be harvested by anyone, I'll need to improve things from a safety standpoint. Of course, I'm still grateful for your assistance. This data will fuel future research. Come harvest whenever you like, I'll be here waiting for you. I still haven't figured out the, where the fucking thing is. Uh, anyway, um... Oh, that's a way bigger spin, yeah. I think I still like this one the most. Where's my whole mill? Whole mill. Whole mill. Gotta be buried somewhere. Or not. Oh, <laughs> fuck your bed. Do I have to maybe talk with one of the cats or something? Or? And I also still haven't found a use for the teddy bear yet, either. The fruit being grown downstairs is toxic to cats. The nerve, anyone growing something that is certainly not... Anyone's growing something like that is certainly not one of my people, friends. Hmm. It's rank mango research. Norma's always talking about you. She's always in a fantastic mood saying you helped her make great progress in her research. Been challenging. Don't risk yourself too hard, okay? Do I have to maybe get like a hundred percent of the mangoes or something? I don't think I got a hundred percent in any of them before, so. Get those trampolines up already.
That's 100%. Cool. Do I get a special reward for 100%? Let's make you harvest all of them. Thank you for such valuable data. I've got a large amount for you to take with you, too. Why does it say I can get... Things from here. No clue. That's just instant. That's supposed to be like that. Lionel. <laughs> uh, I have no fucking clue. Oh, because I was spawning in the wrong fucking creatures. I wasn't spawning in the, the hole mills at all. They can't dig in the sand, though, unfortunately. No clue. They can't dig in here, so... That's annoying. Yeah. Cool. Uh. Maybe I have to get a hundred percent all three? I oh. really don't know. Kind of was not the case because, uh... hundred percent on that last one seems very difficult. It's all 60. Cool. Ow. Oh. Oh. These too. You're just full of surprises. We got the valuable data. Thanks to this. Please, I insist you take this. Oh, there we go. Cool. Three mic crystals. Awesome. Wait, that means that... If I get 100% of the third one, I might get a heart piece. Hey, Bella. Oh. <coughs> Crap. Fuck, yeah, there we go. That's not 100%. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> yes. Uh. Instead of a participation oh. reward, we get a participation fee. Fantastic. <laughs> I don't, need, I don't even need the trampoline, I'm gonna just jump up here. We have the jumping thing on. Right. There we go, that's 100%. Cool. Yeah, I forgot. I only need the trampoline before because I didn't have the jumping bangle thing. That doubles my jump height. Exquisite. You, you've harvested everything. You've vastly exceeded my expectations. Thank you for this wonderful data. Please take this. Special bonus gift from me. I was right. Cool, we need three more now. Please take the tough mangoes you harvested with you as well. Hi. Come harvest whenever you like. I'll be here waiting for you. Man, there's still so many fucking things left. Okay, that was the, uh... That was one around here. I do feel. Uh, let, let's chat. Something in particular. A warm mixed special. I don't make anything called. Oh, do you mean a warm mixed special? You make that one by mixing warm pepper with milk and grapes or a tough mango. Wait, what was the... We have an... I guess it must have been the tough mango that was the last item we didn't have. We have them now, so that's cool. I must have been out of them or something. Oh, yeah, you know, this might be the only place to get tough mangoes, so yeah. You got a warm mixed special. Go back to the... Back to here. Ugh. So yeah, it's not a heart container, so we actually need all four heart pieces. We probably get another heart piece from getting all the stamps. There might be another acorn hunt where we get uh, more heart pieces, but I think I have to talk to you. Oh, again, did you get that smoothie I asked for? Yes, a warm mixed special. That was it. Thanks ever so much. Would you give it to my friend over there? Hmm, the fishes aren't biting today. This is a long time to stand in the chilly wind. Oh, a delivery for me? Oh, it smells real good. And that color sure makes it appealing. Okay, I'll try it. And it's spicy and sweet. How does that even work? Never tasted anything like it. I can tell these are going to be a habit. Oh, I feel my body warming up too. I was just getting, I was getting chilly, so this was just perfect. I don't know who sent this, but please thank them. <laughs> hmm? oh, are you happy too? <laughs> You're such a cutie. Guess I gotta give it on my own and catch you some dinner. Bella. Hi, baby girl. Thank you, it was lovely to treat my dear friend to a taste of my homeland. And here's your reward. Cool. Only one. Okay, one. I'll try. I'll try to get used to the local fare. She tries so hard. I can meet her in the middle. We have seven. I need eighteen more. There's one somewhere around here. Somewhere around here. <laughs> it doesn't even get me high enough now. The water is probably the best bet. Here 
Maybe it's up here? There, why can't you dig around here? Oh, it's right here. Seventeen more now. I do want to come in here. Go all the way down to here. I'm assuming it's just like ingredients or rupees or something, but I'm still rude. Yeah, 50 rupees, okay. Like, my the thing wasn't going off, so couldn't have been anything too important. Like, can I? I could have done that this whole time, huh? That's kind of frustrating, actually. <laughs> I spent like half an hour on that puzzle, and I could have just done that. Oh, they found me. They'll never find me now. That worked? Okay, cool. Zap. <laughs> oh shit, I missed this one completely. Another stamp. Two more. And a warp I missed. Hmm. Okay. That's actually kind of surprising. Okay, that looks like it's uh, one, but I got that. Oh, the rental horse. It's going off. Somewhere around here. This, maybe? Yeah. I was right. Fantastic. I was going to bring this horse back to the ranch. I feel bad about it being out here. This is the wrong way to the ranch. Actually, hold on. Get these stupid clothes off. Don't need rubies now, so I want this. Yeah, I don't know if there's anything out here, but I don't know if there isn't anything out here, so. Here somewhere. All right, all right, right here probably. On one of these maybe. Or maybe specifically the enemy. Oh, 
Oh, it's right here. Yeah. Cool. Fifteen more. Knock out all these areas to uh, make sure I'm not missing any mic crystals around here. Again, I'm assuming I got all of the um, um, all the rifts. There might be one more in the Eternal Forest, but I don't know. pieces, 15 might stones, and two stamps. Get out of here, Razor Cortex. I don't care. What's going off? Oh, here. Fourteen left. Fifty rupees. Give me that. Give me that. Thank you. I missed this one too, because I don't think I've ever actually come in and does it the proper way before. Wait, isn't there a stamp thing near here? Probably, and I missed it. <laughs> It's been just about seven hours, so I'm going to call it here, and we will be finishing up the game tomorrow. So, uh, yeah. Um, as always, thank you everyone for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. And if you did and aren't already following, be sure to do so. So that way you're notified next time I go live, which will be tomorrow. Uh, originally the plan was tomorrow I was going to start doing horror games, but I do want to finish this game, so tomorrow I will be finishing Echoes of Wisdom. So... Be sure to check out the Discord, where you can hang out with myself as well as the rest of chat. Be sure to check out the YouTube, where you can check out all my latest VODs, including today's will be on there. Thank you, Rox, for those. And let's see who might be live for a raid. Open Twitch. Finish it in a Halloween costume. I don't know if I have any Halloween costumes. That's the problem. <laughs>
Oh, okay. Not the game, I thought. I saw someone with The Legend of Zelda beneath, I'm like, oh, okay, cool. And then, no, they're playing Ocarina of Time. Which is... Surprising. Oh, it's their first playthrough, nice. Uh... Rox, who should I raid? I got three here. <clears throat> do I have a die here? I don't think I do. Give me games. Uh, we got Ocarina of Time, Mario Wonder, and then whatever Stern's playing. TCG Card Shop Simulator? <laughs> Ow. Mario Wonder? Alright. Sounds good. Ow. I know nothing about Mario Wonder, so... Yeah. Uh, Rocks, you already have the read message in. Thank you for that. So we will be raiding... Ah, uh, come on. If I can type it correctly. Our good friend, Dragon Tamer Tom. Wait, I gotta make sure he's not ending. No, he just started a couple hours ago, so it doesn't look like he's ending anytime soon. So yeah, we're gonna be raiding Dragon Tamer Tom. He's always fun to hang out with. So yeah, um, as always, I hope you all have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day or your night, and I will see you all later. Peace out, everyone.